Okay. Let's see if this worked. Let's see if we got this working. Nope, it is not working. It will work. Alright, it says not. Oh, it is working. Is it working? Hey guys, you see me? You looking at me? You guys looking at me? Here are the wonderful, wonderfuls. If you look, you looking, you looking at me? Oh shit. Oh, it's working. Yeah. Oh. Hello, friends. How you doing? Welcome to our UFC Vegas 25 for Chaska versus Reyes. Fight buddies on the couch. Romantic. Ladies and gentlemen, we were not going to do this because on the other side over there is a, is a baby and a woman that just gave birth yesterday. Legit yesterday. So tonight's stream will be a Romantic reaction, maybe some baby screams in the background. Uh, welcome to say welcome Ellie in the chat. Welcome to the world, Ellie, the new MMA hole. Um, uh, JBM will be a vocal point. She'll be, you'll hear her, but you're not going to see her. And I think we all understand why. Um, thank you guys for joining us. Uh, I appreciate it. Super chat. Kenda, what the? Kenda, Kendall. Let's go, Mirab. Kiss Mark Hart. <laughs> Let's go, Mirab. Yes. Let's go. Yeah, he's fighting tonight. So this fight night, it's really good. I, now, the only fight I saw was the final fight of the preliminaries. And can I get some Aljos in the chat, please? Can I can I get some Aljos in the chat? Because that young lady was full of it. She was full of what my baby has right now. You want me to hold her? You want me to hold her while... No? Okay. Oh, right, Jesse's uh, breastfeeding right now. Uh, thank you, Kendall, for the donation. Appreciate that. Yeah, Aljo. Oh, look at all those Aljos in the chat. Aljos in the chat, baby. Aljos. I mean, there was no doubt about it. That. I mean, listen. It was an illegal shot, yes. But my God. My God, the acting in that. All right. So this is not like our typical type of stream. I'm literally just on a couch, and on the other side of you guys is the fights. Um, I don't even have the fights pinned, uh, but ESPN Plus, link in the description. I want to shout out all the sponsors, uh, Head Rush, um, Mystic Roots Can you CBD. give us your best Valley Jay Girl Smokey, accent? What up, Jay Smokey? Like, oh my God. My God. My God. Like, oh my God. Really? Look at that. What up, Jay Smokey? How you doing? You mean no bad bongos. LOL, congrats, guys. <laughs> thank you, Jay Smokey. Really, seriously, thank you very much. All right, so Marab is the fight that we're going to start with. Marab versus Cody Stamen is going to be our first fight of the night. I'm going to lower you guys a little bit over here. And um, who knows? We might get a, a surprise appearance of the new edition. We'll see. It all depends on if, if mom needs a little help. Because mom is, she's been putting in work. Jess, you want to say hi? She said hi. Yeah, she's a little tired, man. We didn't sleep last night at all. Like, not one. I mean, I slept, what, maybe I got a good three hours in, some, somewhere around there. So, I mean, I guess it could be worse, right? Ellie the Queen. Uh, poor hospital tonight. So, here's Cody Stamen. I tell you what, Marab, a lot of people are picking uh, Marab, and Cody's a tough dude. Real tough dude. So, if you're just jumping in, if you're new to the channel, basically what I'm going to be doing is a, a f fight reaction. They fight buddies. We've been doing this forever, and I couldn't miss this night. I know I missed the prelims. I, I think we had good reason. But tonight, we're just going to be chilling. You're going to know all the results. If you don't get a fantastic play-by-play, -play, I apologize, because I'm literally just here watching fights and telling you what I see. Um, but yeah, thank you, George, for the congratulations. Welcome to Team No Sleep. It has just begun. Yeah, I know. I know. It's, it's going to get real. Uh, the following streams are going to be back in the studio uh, we will be, you know, splitting duties and stuff like that. There's going to be no clock. Um, the fights are just going to start. There's going to be a delay, too, because I'm on a fire stick. Wow, Marab looking ferocious. Cody Stamen in great shape. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's, 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 let's food can do this. All right, so they touch gloves. Marab looking pretty thick. It's a big fight for uh, the Valishvili. 
who's got that ground game. He's backing up, and here comes Cody Stamen. Jess, who did you pick in this fight? Do you remember? Oh, you didn't? Did you pick the card or no? Oh, I just took off. I picked the card lousy. I'll, I'll check out our Pick'em League in a sec. I don't even know how the hell I did. I don't even know who won. All I know is, oh, there's a head kick by Stamen on Marab. Marab was like, whoa, he was a little stunned there, but he shook it off. Marab fights out of Law MMA. And it's wonderful, wonderful. Everyone smash the like button if you like babies. If you don't like babies, then don't even bother. But if you like babies, hit the like button because we, oh, yo, fucking Marab. I gotta, I gotta be careful. I can't be yelling and screaming. There's a jab by Stamen, a nice hook. So Stamen winning on the feet here. In the first round, Stamen looking pretty good. The one-two coming in by Stamen. Rob light on his feet, bouncing around. Oh, man, there he goes. Scooping up the leg and Rob coming down with the hammer fist. This is what he does. Oh, Rob's got like the most freaking takedowns here at Bantamweight, and he does it again. Cody Stamen is sprawling from the bottom. Rob trying to scoop up those legs. This dude is relentless when he gets you on the ground. I'm telling you, man, this dude is very similar. He's, he's just like Habib, man. I, it just, it's, it's just nuts, man, how good he is, dominant on the ground. So Stamen does use the cage to get back up. Let's see if Stamen can keep on the feet here as Marab wraps around the waist. A left and a right, and they separate. So Marab landed. Marab did another thing that he has his cardio for days, which makes this fight very interesting. Cody Stamen's got some uh, cardio as well. And yo, da Dr. Uh, Dre, excuse me, Dr. Dre. Dre Angle, oh, a nice body shot by Marab. Thank you. Underhooks, and there we go, Dr. Dre. Round of applause for Dr. Dre Angle. I don't have any sound effects, so I'm just going to go like this. Our baby's on Jesse's boob. You used to it yet? Yeah. Okay, guys. Back into the action. I'm, by the way, I'm a dad, man. Could you freaking believe this? I'm a dad. Uh, what's up, Chris? Uh, Papa Moss, how you doing, Commander-in-Chief? How you doing? So happy for your new addition. Uh, salute Queen Ellie. Yes, Queen Ellie is here. Actually, uh, Jesse's the queen. Ellie's the princess. So, she's a cutie too, man. I, I'm, I'm biased. I'm biased. I'm her dad. Here we go. They're swinging. They're connected. So, Marab had a chance to uh, hold down Stamen. Stamen does get up, and that's a win for Cody Stamen. Stamen coming forward. Stamen's got to get a dub here, man. What is he on? A... Did he win his last fight? Where are we at with Cody Stamen? By the way, the next fight is a banger. Sean Strickland. Here we go. Marab going for the takedown. Law MMA. And stop by Stamen. Stamen wrapping around. Stamen using that strength. Try to tie up Marab, and Marab separates. Really good first round. I got 205 left in the first. And like I said, there's going to be a delay. So I apologize. Wow, Marab looking ferocious, though. He's got this look on his face. Got the beard going. What do you think about Marab with the beard? All right, looking, he's looking he's looking manly now. <laughs> so, oh, Cody's standing on a one-fight losing streak, which is kind of wild how steep of an underdog he is oh man Marab trying to go for the combo and then disguise the takedown but stopped by Cody Marab's got a smile on his face but oh nice job by Marab here we go with the ends alone Phil Star Phil fucking Star yeah let's go so Cody bringing it now Ends in the chat, ends in the chat. Phil Star. Congress, guys. So happy for the healthy baby, and Jess, you're going to be an awesome mom. Sure. Smiley face, fist. Folded hands. Shout out to Phil Starr. Thank you so much for that donation. And Jesse said thank you as well. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate it. She will be a good mom. I do believe it. So, by the way, these one-twos by Marab. Ferociously hitting the fucking thick-necked Cody Stamen. Nice jab there by Marab. Again, yo, Marab's getting better, man. He is getting better. He's got a big smile on his face. Look at another fucking hands. Yo, take that, Marab. Hands coming in again. Phil Starr. Sound the alarms, baby. Tell the beat told about 
taste of the MMA holes. Phil Starr. Congress, guys. So happy for the healthy baby and Jess, you're going to be an awesome mom. Smiley face, <laughs> fist, folded hands. I think you did it twice. Phil Starr, thank you. My God. That was a double dip right there. Phil Starr, thank you. If you're just jumping into the stream, where are the MMA holes? We literally just drove from the hospital. We had a baby. We drove from the hospital. And we love the UFC so much that we decided, hey, let's go live. Now, Jesse's here with me too, but the, the, the baby's on the boob. So, she's... Robot's well! Goodness, man. Robot 12. Holy shit, Chubbs. Chubbs. My God, thank you. Congratulations. Welcome to parenthood. Your life is now over as you know it. <laughs> but at least now you can get drunk. JBM drinks on me. Jesse, ready to drink? Yeah, it looks like she's ready to drink. She's breastfeeding now. By the way, we're in the second round. And ladies and gentlemen, Cody Stamen just took down Marab. As he's doing it, Marab is elbowing into the ribs. Chubbs, thank you. Phil Starr, thank you, everyone. Oh, my God. Marab is vicious. Hammer fist to the ribs. So Cody Stamen gets the takedown, and Marab is just wrecking him on the ribs. But how about Cody nailing the, the takedown here? Trying to beat Marab at his own game. Cody now putting some left hands in on Marab's head. Damn. the under And Marab gets back up. Cody wraps the arms around the waist. And guys and gals, thank you so much. They separate. So Marab somehow gets out of that situation. But the dude's a lunatic. Cody Stamen, nice job there. Stamen looking not to get run over here like everyone else does. Marab basically just taking everyone down, dominating. And here comes Marab going for a takedown, throwing that right hand and just dragging him down by the neck. Cody Stamen on his knees. <sighs> My goodness. By the way, we have 338 left in a second round. That's where we're sitting right now of UFC Fight Night Vegas, smash the like button, please. So like I was saying before, we came from the hospital, Jesse gave birth yesterday, no problems, right? Like a trooper, went in there, zero issues. So shout out to Jesse, right? You were built for this. She's exhausted, by the way. She's got a, a baby on the boob. <clears throat> Ellie's the next Ronda Rousey, that's what the nurse said. We avoided the conversation of um, what we did the whole entire time until the last nurse came in and she she got it out of us. All right, here we go. So here we go. Marab shooting for a takedown and nails it again. Okay, but... You crashing the show? You crashing? Hey man, thank you, Joe B. Ellie crashed the show. Congratulations, <laughs> you two. Ellie did crash the show, yes. By the way, we got a barn burner here. On the main card, Devalishvili versus Stamen has been fire since the start. And it's Cody Stamen standing his ground. This is a close fight. Ah, oh, super chat. That's Graham Hull coming in. I've got Cute Lab, Strickland. Chikad and Reyes, what do you think? All right, what we got? You got Cootie Lava, Strickland. I got all the same guys. I don't know if that's good or bad, but I got all the same guys. By the way, oh my God, Marab with a takedown, doubles up on the legs, lifts up Co Cody Stamen in the center of the octagon and drops him down on his ass. Big takedown in the second. It's got to be so frustrating. I tell you what. Marab Devalishvili. Can this guy be champ? Now, I know Cody Stamen's putting up a, a fight with him. But Marab is relentless. Can he be a champ? Oh, that's a nice right hook by Marab coming in there. Cody hitting to the body. 
Here comes Cody. He's looping in right hands. So we got 45 seconds left in the second round. Thank you, boys and girls, for joining. We got booby traps. Jealousy. In honor of Ellie getting a lot of milky booby trapped. Congrats, Moss and JBM. Thank you, Sonosi. Appreciate that, man. It really means a lot. With all the congrats coming in from the community, I really appreciate it, guys. That's really cool. By the way, on this card, I am three right, three wrong. And the last one I'm right on, not too proud of because um, that was the one where uh, Panero fucking mailed it in. By the way, Cody Stamen uh, ending this second round on top of Marab. Does that win the round? I don't know. But we'll find out, as this thing looks like it's destined for a decision. Very good back and forth, though, between the two. All right, let's see what's going on in this chat, man. We got 259 hanging here on a fight night. Fucking cool stuff. Like I said, we can't. We just literally came from the hospital. And here we are, hanging with you guys. So appreciate your company. Uh, stopping traffic. Yo, what up, guy? What up, Mike H. And Hound Dog and Smokey and Eddie Machete. Drunk Savage. All the people, the party people here on a Saturday night. Let's go, Cody Stamen. He lives in my city. Well, Danny, Mar well, actually, Marab doesn't live in my city anymore, right? Because I moved. But he's a low MMA guy, so I'm, I'm, I'm kind of rooting for Marab here. But good luck to Cody. He's doing pretty good in this fight. Uh, thank you, Shoe Nice. I said for now, uh, second. Super chat. But why? Congrats, Chris. I know you'll be a great father. Thank you, Boat. I appreciate that. It was very kind of you. A patron over there. Wonderful, wonderful. We're in the third round right now. Third round of action between Marab and Cody Stamen. And you got to give it to Cody Stamen. The dude has looked very good in this fight. It's very close. I'm just going to say 1-1. One, one. That's what I'm going to go with on this one. Let's see who wins this thing. Baby's being good. She's still feeding. So you want me to put her to rest and you can relax? You sure? I can put her in the thing. I changed a couple of diapers. Bad though. I'm not very good at it. Nor am I good at the swaddle, but I'll master it. Uh, congrats, y'all. I'm so happy for you. Thank you, uh, Leo England. Appreciate that, man. Welcome to the world, Ellie. You hit... Lotto on Cool Parents. Congratulations, guys. Thank you, CJ. That's, that's really cool of you. All right, here we go. Four minutes left in this fight. Let's see the fireworks. There's Cody Stamen coming in with the jab. Swings over the top with the right. Misses. Marab reset into the middle. Oh, head kick coming in by Marab. So Marab basically peppering some attacks here. Just trying to land that takedown. The one-twos were working early in the fight. Marab coming with the combo. And then Cody hits as well. They both collide. And... Ooh, man. So 335 left in the round. Cody Stamen trying to spin around for a head kick. And Rob goes like this. And I guess he's taunting. But damn, Rob is... He's... he Every fight, he's only bouncing around. First to last round. Cardio like crazy. Ooh, a nice counter left by Stamen. That land beautifully. Cody, Cody Stamen. Here's Rob again coming with the left. Jab by Stamen. Both boys hit with the jabs. All right, now 3.05 left in this fight. This could go any way. This is a fight. Ooh, they're colliding here. And Marab trying to go for a single leg. And then cracks him with a hook. Beautiful left hand by Marab. Cody Stamen kind of went stumbling to the cage. Ooh, Cody Stamen timed a knee that landed perfectly on Marab's face. And Marab just eats it and brushes it off his shoulder. <sighs> Ooh, Cody Stamen, sneaky. Now Cody realized he got him with that. And Rob shoots for another takedown, goes for the single, and mm -hmm. Cody swipes away again. I tell you what, these stopped takedowns by uh, Stamen looking really good. And Rob just looping punches and missing. Cody Stamen might win this fight. Uh, no, I'm not doing this from the hospital. Nope. But by the way, by me whispering, I feel like I'm fucking uh, MMA guru right now, Jess, right? Is this what he does? Just whispers into the camera. Oh my god! Oh my god! When we're back in the studio, we won't be whispering. 
Who won uh, Ariel or, or Ruiz? I don't know. I only caught the last fight of the preliminaries on here. I literally, We literally went live when we came back from the hospital. That's how nutty we are on this channel. Dedication. That's why you got to hit that like button. You got you to gotta smash. More combos coming in by Devalish Feely. And Cody Stamen rocking him with a right. Whoo! Mira, oh, he gets the takedown there. But then Stamen stops it and gets into his guard. Oh, Stamen might win this fucking fight. Thank you, Omar. I'm grateful for you got your company. Trust me. I am grateful for your company. Uh, so Marab super in trouble shit. here. Boyak with the 499, my man. Wonderful, wonderful. Thank you. Appreciate it. So Cody Stamen finishing this fight. It's a Super Grim. chat. I'm pissed at earlier fight. Sanders clearly won. Mm. Oh, so he got robbed on that one? I got to go back and watch the earlier fights. I started with Marcos. I literally started with the Aljo fight. Rolling into the main card. So, Alexa, stop. A lot of noise going on here. By the way, Cody Sam uh, Saman might be, he might win this fight. He's ending this thing. Inside the guard of Marab. Marab's trying to attack the leg as Stamen stands over him. They got 37 seconds left in this round. Third round, final round. And Marab trying to get back up. Shooting in, grabbing the leg and taking down Stamen. But Stamen tangling up Marab. Holy shit. That is Ellie's first comment. Yep. You were here for Ellie's first comment. So Marab, man, tangled up on the mat. He might take an L. It might happen here. This thing looks like it's going to the judges. UFC Vegas 25. They are back up to their feet. Stamen coming with the right hand. Five seconds left. Both boys swinging. Marab tangles him up. Has him against the fence. And that's how the fight ends. What do you guys think? By the way, Strickland fights next. That's going to be fucking... That's going to be crazy. What do you guys think? Marab, who was on a nice little win streak. Law MMA. Big favorite. Cody Stamen, I think, stopped the party. Princess Ellie had 300 uncles. That's true. Uh, you're a savage, Moss. Congrats. Thank you, Carl. You're savage. Uh, congratulations. Uh, Leo, LOL Champs is Leo England. But why? Uh, send a request on Facebook. Rob2928 says Jeremiah. Ellie already famous. Yeah, she's she's sleeping now. Look at her. Oh, my God. She's on the chest. She ate good? Okay. I heard Ellie's first cry and my day's complete. Great fight. Yeah, man. Beginning to end. Non-stop action. Must go and kill a few boys in coming years. It's gonna be a while. But yeah. Today, I'm in the I'm in the um what's it called? They were doing like tests and stuff like that. I'm in the room and there's a, a boy baby there. I'm like, you, you just keep your eyes off my kid. You understand me? Keep your eyes, you little fat bastard. Keep you little chunky baby, get the, get away. Get away from my little girl. I didn't tell Jesse that story. But that's what I did. I looked at I looked the baby in the eyes. As the baby was in the little uh those little plastic compartments, and I'm like, you little shithead, you little chunky little shithead. I know you're getting tested right now, but I see you looking at my little girl. Back off. Don't laugh, it's not funny. Anyway, let's let's find the results over here. Yeah, Ellie's a little she's a little peanut compared to these other babies. Alright, here we go. Rob's got his papa ha ha ha. Who's going to win this fight? I think Cody Stamen might have won. Unanimous. Marab got it. This... Ooh, I tell you what, I feel for Cody Stamen. This is what Marab does. This is what Marab... This is what he does. I tell you what, five rounds of Marab. Think about this. When he starts... Getting up there. There's a Ray Longo, baby. There he is. That's a win for Law MMA. Marab, here's the problem, though. When, when I was talking to Marab, I asked him if he would fight Aljo. He said, no way. I mean, if Aljo is hanging out up there, their paths, they're going to collide. But, uh, yeah, big win for Law MMA right there. But, oh, shit, that's Wilson Drajoni. You see that? In this corner? 
Wilson Drejone, who was a, a, a Triton Fights champ. That guy's a beast, by the way. See the guy behind Marab with the mask on. There's a dude, UFC jacket, mask that was in his corner. I think he's another Georgian guy. I could be wrong, but I think they pretty much have the same heritage. That's fucking Wilson. Good for that kid. He'll be in the UFC soon. Wilson, his name is Wilson Drejone. Triton Fights champ. I don't know if there's any Triton Fights people in the chat, but that, that kid's a stud. He's a young stud. We saw him fight a bunch of times. I had Moran by decision. That's like that's like a money pick, right? Right, right. One, one, one. How was that hospital food? <laughs> they gave us um, a special meal, though. They gave us like a couple special meal, like a little shrimp over pasta, which was all right. But um, today, terrible. And funny story. I got a funny story for you guys. No Lux per day. And you know how I am when it looks per day. So here I am in the bathroom, and I'm going. This hospital food had me, it was like Drano on me. And I blew this bathroom up so fucking bad that when the nurse came and she fucking hit the floor, she fell down. We had to revive her. They had to bring in the paramedics. They had to bring everyone in. No, it was embarrassing. I blew up the bathroom. I was like, oh shit, what do we do? We have no spray or nothing. And she was laughing. And then the, I'm like, the nurse is not going to go. Why is she going to go in there? And what does she do? She walks in a room, and the, like the first thing she does is like, "Do you have so and so in the bathroom? Do you have so what?" I don't know. She's stocking something up. She swings the door open, walks right into hell, and I'm like, oh. <laughs> one, <laughs> "She's one in there. there! Get her out!" Did you think about the haircut guy? No. Are you the one that said, "Oh, glove touch"? Yeah. I, it was so funny that you said that. I don't know where you said it before. But I was crying last... was in Discord? Where did Glove Touch say that? Do you remember? I can't remember where you said it, but um, I was dying laughing because I read it right after uh, Jesse gave birth. And he didn't even come into my head. I'm like... But imagine if the haircut guy came into my head at that moment where Ellie... Like, I literally watched Ellie's head coming out of Jesse's beaver. That's kind of weird, man. It's It's, it's strange. But you know what? I'm like a squeamish, squirmish person. And um, it didn't bother me. It's kind of bizarre, man. They're like, it's going to be beautiful. I'm holding her leg. I'm like, I'm going to vomit. I didn't cut the cord, though. I could have, probably. But I, I just, I, I just before, I said, I let's, let's, not, let's not do that. That little piece of ziti hanging from the baby. and just, No, I'm good. Thank you, Hunter. Appreciate it. Thank you, Nico. Appreciate it. But yeah, no bidet. No bidet. That's I told him I need to go home, not just not for the UFC fights. By the way, Marab is up being interviewed right now. Marab Devalishvili gets the dub. If you're new to this, I uh, well, I didn't have a baby. Jesse had a baby. It's my daughter, but Jesse had the baby. I, she did all the work. I stood there and did nothing really. I held her leg for a second. I did eat the placenta. Yeah, that's what we had. That was a celebratory dinner. Who is controlling the hospital food ordering uh, worldwide? I don't know what the fuck. I don't know. Hospital food's weird. And when they hand you the hospital food, that they have the guy come in, open the door. He comes in. He's like, like he gives you the look like you're really going to eat this shit. <laughs> it's like a tray plate. And they plop the thing on top to keep it warm. And he's like, you ordered this? I hate when there's no bidet. Yeah, so yeah, getting back to that, Lux Bidet, link in the description for 10% off. You need it. And and today I needed it bad. I was tr I was having trouble in that bathroom today. Trouble. And yesterday, it was terrible. So Adesanya versus Vittori is a done deal. It's in Glendale. See that? It's in Arizona. June 12th. Oh, that's close. Ellie, you want to go to a fight? You want to go to Ellie? You want to go to the fights? What if we pull the MMA holes onesie on Ellie and just with the stroller? MMA holes. You guys want to meet Ellie? Yeah, my Everyone's tossing Ellie around. <laughs> no? Ellie, Ellie, like a crowd of MMA holes with Ellie in the fight. Ah, oh, like super chat. Can't control her neck. Jeremiah. Congrats, and I pray many blessings for her family. Thank May you. the Most High give you wisdom in parenting. It'll be 42 at midnight, so I'll remember this birthday. Happy birthday, Jeremiah. 
I'm 42 years old. Ah, you're still young. You're still counting. 44, for God's sakes. You'll always be younger than me. You'll feel always feel good. Um, thank you, Jeremiah. I appreciate that. Yeah, right? What do you think? Here we go. Strickland's about to fight. Let's look at goat milk. Who we got on top of goat milk? Thank you guys for joining us. Seriously, it, it feels good. I, I'm fucking, I'm exhausted. Poor Jessie's. She's got the baby on it. The baby's sleeping. You think the baby's used to us rambling and stuff? Or you think she's just been fed? She's drunk. Yeah. Okay. Let's look at goat milk. Let's look. I'm going to need prayers. For sure. Because, um, I'm lost. I don't know what I'm doing. I really don't know what I'm doing. Uh, hey, Poland, man. Coding is the game. How you doing, Poland? How you doing? Um, if you're new to this, there's a little story here. We just got back from the hospital. We had a baby. Jesse had a baby. I, I, I watched. I have a little girl and a big girl sitting right next to me. And uh, we decided we're still going live for these fights. We go live for all the UFC fights. And it was killing me. I was sitting in the hospital room. We had the prelims on while the nurse is trying to give me instructions. And all I'm thinking is, I want to watch these fights. Were you listening to the lady? I don't think she was listening either. Ellie, were you listening? Were you listening? No, she wasn't listening either. So basically, if you like to hang out, we'll be back in the studio on the other streams. But this is just, you know, we're just randomly going for it. All right, I'm going to look at uh, goat milk. Okay. Do you want me to hold her? I'll hold her. I mean, I'll just I'll football her. Like a football. Let me do that. Just got the pass pacifier. One, you want to just want to try the, the bed? I'll tell you what. Bought some youth stonk today. I'm about to ban the schmo from all events. <laughs> You're gonna ban the schmo from all events? What did you say before that? I bought some UFC stonk today. Oh man, you got that stock? And anyone else buy stock? Actually, you're 15. Can you buy stock at 15? How does that work? Thank you, Turk. Appreciate that, man. Live from the couch, Moss is sleeping on. I've slept on this couch before. I've slept. I've, I've been. I've been. This couch has been through some hard times with me. We've been. We've worked together, and not with Jesse though. Before Jesse, this couch came from New York. It's been been through a lot. Me and this couch. You'll figure it out. Little girls are something special. Yeah. Some uh, one of the nurses was saying that's good to have a girl first because when you have other kids, girls are more um, inclined to help you out with the younger kids. I never really thought of it that way. And boys, we're stupid, right? We're like, like, huh? like I had a younger brother like, ah, huh? like, like, what's that? But my neighbor has a, a girl, and she just had a son. Girls like putting a pacifier in the mouth, helping mommy out, change diapers, this and that. Like, we're like idiots. So maybe it's better that I have the girl first. I guess. I don't know. If we ever have any more kids, we have a helping hand. All right, so goat milk, carper time. What? <laughs> have we ever had someone go back to back? Carper won last week, right? Yo, Carper's at 475 on our Pick'em League. Right, Ellie? 475. Five decisions, seven correct. My goodness. Nice job, Carper. Ah, uh, super yeah. chat. Graham. Bought 1,500 shares of Dogecoin today. Jump on the train. I, I should, right? I wish I had someone that could tell me what to do with that stuff. I, I don't I don't know what I'm doing. And now that I have a daughter, like I feel weird invested. Like I should, right? I know I should, but uh Yeah, Ellie was cheering for Carpa Tom. She didn't say a damn word until she found out Carpa was still in, was in first place again. Yeah, Dodge Coin, Dog Coin. These coins, big coins, my coin. Oh, here's Ozzy Cat. Ozzy Cat's in the chat. You want to show Ozzy Cat her granddaughter? 
or is she comfy? All right, you gotta see the head on hair, the head of hair on this kid. Okay, ready? Are you gonna? Okay, yeah. You gonna go this? I'm this way. So I'm a. Uh, this is for some reason. Um, it's a circle of life. Look at the fucking hair on this kid. Oh, you need to breathe, don't you? Okay, so she's looking. Look at the hair on this kid. Okay, I gotta keep her straight. No, it's football. Her head needs to be straight the whole time. There you go. Okay. How you doing, Ellie? All right, let's go down like this. Meet Ellie. This is uh, Ozzy Cat's granddaughter. Look at the hair. By the way, she's got, she's got a little, she got a little, little tint. She got a little tint. She got my, she got my ginger tint. She got Jesse's puss face. So look. see her there she is uh no we just found this this is not my child i found her actually she was on my doorstep i gotta give her back to the church look at that she's awesome yeah man thank you guys thank you look at the little mma hole here she just had uh she was just hanging off of jesse's booby this these lips are on jesse's booby so sean strickland ellie you ready for this fight yeah she's ready for this fight Okay, ready, Ellie? Let's do this. Sean Strickland's gonna fight, guys. We're gonna party with Sean Strickland. So Marab gets the win, unanimous decision. We got some good fights. Kudi Lala versus Jacoby is really good. So this is Yoko versus Sean Strickland. My goodness. This fight cannot suck. Okay, Ellie, you ready? You pumped up? Okay, Ellie's ready. Thank you, guys, thank you. Appreciate it. Likes for Ellie, likes in the stream for a new baby. If you have a heart, you put a light on, like on the stream. So Strickland is 30 years old. Yoko is 31. They're both six foot tall. Yoko, 77 inch reach. Sean Strickland, 76. 77, 76. So there we go. Okay. Inch difference there in favor of Yoko. I pick Strickland. We'll see how that goes. But uh, yeah, that, that's crazy. It's a baby ginger. Yeah, look. They don't really... Actually, a lot of them exist over... But look at this... How much hair do we got? You can't see her eyebrows though. I shaved them off. She got long eyelashes too. Okay, here we go, here we go. Thanks, Mike. Uncle Mike H. Uncle C. All the uncles, in, where are my uncles at in the chat? All the uncles are in the chat. Now, Ellie, I apologize in advance. This Yoko Strickland fight is gonna be good. It's gonna be good, man. This is gonna be a really, I might throw the baby in the air. I might throw the baby. By the way, I have some weird, there was a weird thing about domestic violence that the hospital, it was like the narrative of the whole trip. Like there's a, it's a big thing these days, domestic violence, when you have a baby, like what the hell, what kind of, what kind of world do we live in, man? The cops are there and shit. Right, here we go, Yoko versus, Yo, Yoko. Joko versus Strickland. They touch gloves, they're ready to go. Ellie, we're in round number one. Okay. Wonderful, wonderful. It's Manny C. It's Manny C. You have the pacifier? Moss and Jesse, congrats on your little one. What a time to be alive. YouTube, the internet. Just a few years ago, we would have never have met. Now you and Jesse can only wish we had never met. Lol. But this community is a family. You're right. Welcome, little Ellie. You're right. Thank you, Manny C. It's so true. By the way, like Strickland does, he's walking forward. Yoko backing up with that lead hand out there trying to push the jab out. Strickland just kind of inching forward. Ooh, Strickland hits him with the right. Yoko trying to counter in as Strickland's moving forward. Curious if Strickland's very, he's, he's a talker when he fights. So I'm waiting to see if he's gonna be talking to Yoko. Strickland just walks down his opponents. Never backs up his guy. Give us a I'm going to beat everybody. I'm going to finish everybody, everybody, 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 everybody. I'm going to finish everybody. I'm going to smash everybody. Devious V, look. It's Devious V. Now that the day Walker has spawned, 
We can get ready for triple hosts. <laughs> That's right. Thank you very much for the donations, guys. Thank you so much. We got Strickland. We got Yoko. We got round one going on. We got the people in the chat flying by. We got 325 from all over the world. I got a baby in my hand. And here we go, Yoko trying to blast through a combo to Strickland. But Strickland's still coming forward. Strickland not taking many chances, though. Like, he's being very cautious of his attack as he is walking him down. Taken over. Congratulations, guys. That's cool. You guys are together during a very special moment. Some hospitals don't even allow visitors. No, they allowed two guests this hospital, but we opted not for anything. We were in and out basically. I mean, 24 hours after the, the birth. Here we go. Strickland coming in. Oh, a nice right hand uppercut. Strickland, yo, Strickland got pop. Oh, Strickland coming. Strickland's going for the kill. Come on, Ellie. Ellie, Strickland's going for it. We got 205 left in the first round, by the way. Yoko and Strickland. I like Sean Strickland. Ellie needs some shoes. Guys, support the crown princess. Looks just like me. I, I don't know. Some people say like me. Some people say like Jesse. I think it's too early to tell. Okay. You gonna take a shower? Oh, you heard that? Did you hear that? You take a shower now? No, I'll, I'll hold her. But keep a pacifier close to me. Keep one on deck. Because she tries to go for my, my nipples. She's not getting anything. So, Oh, hi. She's good. Yeah. It's not swollen. Well, I, yeah. I punched her once. Yeah, it's just when she rubs it. She's got, so, she's got sensitive skin. Like me. She likes it. Uh, will you baby girl go to the UFC someday? I've never seen Ginger Champion there before. Well, hmm, Ginger Champ. Yeah, that's true. Spike Carlisle couldn't pull it off. There's not really a Ginger Champion that I can remember. So, same thing as before. 45 seconds left? What? I'll hold on to it. 45 seconds left in this round. Here we go. Strickland has been walking him down. Damn, man. Yoko can't really get anything going. He's just backing up and trying to counter. But it's been all Strickland just walking him down. And you got to think this is very encouraging for Sean Strickland here. You know, Yoko backing up, scared. And Strickland just moving forward. Yoko's trying to catch him with that perfect counter. There's a nice right hand by Strickland. 15 seconds left. Thank you, Jason, for the congrats. Ellie uh, will be a doctor, no fighting. That would be nice. See, Jesse doesn't mind her fighting. But, um, I mean... I mean, there's a lot of career paths. I'd rather her on the mic. Oh, what if she wants to fight? I'll support her. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna turn it down, of course. I want you to be a lover, Jeff. Uh, let's go to Jesse. You know, get on the mic. You can be the next jet. You can be uh, the next JVM. You know. Yeah. All right. So round one's over. I'm, gi I'm giving it to Strickland. If you're just jumping in, it's a little daddy time with the boys. Daddy time over here and the girls, of course. Um, because we have, this is a girl. Oh, you look like you're smiling there, but you probably just pooped. That's Ellie, by the way. Yeah, JBM will be good to go. This is, she literally popped yesterday. And she's moving around, she's doing things. She'll be good to go. Uh, get Ellie into karate or something? Oh, definitely. I would definitely, there's no doubt she's getting into self-defense. Thank you, Jason. Ellie Rose is absolutely adorable. Thank you, Ann. Thank you. All right, so what do you guys think? Round one. I'm It's Strickland, right? Are we all on the same page here? Uh, Daddy's girl. Yeah, holy fook. First two months is great, says Omar. She was born yesterday. Like, legit yesterday. She popped out and all his hair came out. It's like a movie baby. You know when they have movie babies and... You see the baby like that kid is that kid's like it's like twelve months old. 
well, how are we supposed to believe that's a newborn? It's like, oh, it's a, you have a girl. And, and then the, the kid comes out. It's, it's so much older than a newborn. That's what she looks like, right? She just, she just comes out with a full head of hair. Strickland 1-0, oh, Strickland round 1 agreed. Okay, we're on the same page. Ali Penelope Moss. All right, so round two, more of the same. This middleweight fight going down and Strickland moving forward. Here we go. Yoko trying to land to the belly and upstairs. Yoko's trying to, he's trying to stay put here, trying to move Strickland back now. Let's see if he can get it going. Ellie, what do you think is going on here? Please, I'm begging you. Don't ever buy another UFC pay-per-view again. I don't want your money. Pussies. I don't want your money. Pussies, 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 pussies. I don't want your money. Pussies, money, pussies, money, pussies, pussies. You're a moron. <laughs> I don't want your money. Money, money, pussy, pussy, money, pussy, pussy. <laughs> I don't give a f Roberto. I'm pretty sure you guys are tired. Dinner is on me. Hamburger, chips, slice of pizza. Hot dog, sandwich, taco, burrito, stuffed flatbread, pot of food. You hear that? Um, let's do it. By the way, I did have a burrito. I did have a burrito today. Uh, thank you, Roberto, for the $50 donation. Please drop the Hearns in the chat. Please drop the Hearns in the chat. What a man. Strickland still moving forward. A beautiful straight right hand by Strickland on the face of Yoko. So far, I got Strickland up here. It's 255 left in the second round. But who knows? Oh, Yoko eats another right hand by Strickland. Strickland fought Uzi's mom back in the day. Not sure if uh, people remember that. Oh, uh, super chat. Super chat. Oh, HHH, you guys had the baby. Congratulations. Uh. A $10 donation from Blue Chip 17. Ellie, how nice is that? Thank you. Thank you very much. Look at that. You guys are freaking so nice. Does anyone... Do ESPN streak five zero oh, and one need Strickland for six on day one? Uh, Aaron, you got if you talk about pick'em leagues, you got to go to the MMAholes.com. Our pick'em league is the way. I don't know what's going on here. Fuck the fights. Are you okay? Oh, I'm sorry. Am I being too loud? Oh, I'm sorry. You okay? There you go. Just just shake her a little bit. And she'll be fine. Okay. Let's get back into this fight. All right, so 153 left. Oh, a nice kick to the body and then a leg kick by Strickland. Did you, I'm sorry. Did I say that too loud? Jesse's in the bathroom. She's got to be showering up. But we got to scrap here. We got to scrap. Now Yoko's like, enough of this. Yoko's starting to be like, enough is enough. Strickland hasn't been very mouthy, though. He hasn't really said much. He's trying to walk down Yoko. Very serious. Oh, there's that left hand now by Strickland. Popping him with a jab right on the chin. Get to sign her up for Russian baby yoga. She will be a beast. <laughs> Russian baby yoga. Should I set her up a bear? It's the whole deal. Thank you, DVS. We appreciate that. We got 40 seconds left in this thing. Yoko's got the blood trickling out of the mouth, and here comes Strickland just walking him down some more. Nice leg kick by Strickland. Strickland's just breaking this man. Sean Strickland is a guy that we got to start talking about. What he is doing in this fight, very impressive. Patiently just walking down his opponent like like it's nothing. Switching up his strikes. Coming in from different angles here. Constant pressure. And that leg kick is really becoming a problem for Yoko. Yoko trying to come in with those left hands. Yoko's kind of... He's kind of stepping funny on them legs. We got 3-2-1. That's it for the second round. I got Strickland up to zip. Damn. Sean Strickland's kind of limping around there too. CBD. CBD, 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 CBD,
it helps with uh, healing process and uh, inflammation and stuff like that. So you wanted to get these for before or after the fire training and make your life a better place. Welcome to Fatherhood Moss. Little girls are the best. And JBM, you are going to be a great mother. Glad to see all went well. Me and the wife say she is beautiful. Congrats, congrats. Enjoy the little things now they go so, so fast. D4L, dad's for life. Thank you, Jay Smokey. Appreciate that Jesse has jumped in the shower, but I will tell her what you said over there. Appreciate that. And that's right, CBD is wonderful, wonderful. We got a sponsor in case I see some people saying CBD in the chat. You want some CBD? We got Mystic Root CBD. Link in the description down below. Check it out. You get a 20... Actually, no, there's no link in the description. I'm sorry. That's a different sponsor. It's mysticrootscbd.com. Mysticrootscbd.com. And use promo code MMA Holes with an S. M-M-A-H-O-L-E-S for 20% off. Thank you, Jay Smokey, for reminding me. You are absolutely wonderful, wonderful. Oh, boy. Anyway, all right, back into business here. We're in the third round, right? Yeah. Yeah, we're in the third round. Look at those hair. Oh, my God. She goes with hair. She goes with hair. She goes with hair. As long as she stays like this, we're good. She can start crying when Jesse comes back. You like it? You like the fight so far? No? Yeah? I wonder what's going through her mind right now. Why is this guy rambling? All right, back into the game. If you're new to the channel, hit the sub button, notification bell. This is not what we normally do. This is I don't just sit here on a couch with a baby every time the fights are on. That's not what we normally do. Maybe on off streams we'll do something like this, but we're usually in a studio going crazy, having some fun, hanging with the boys and girls. But um, right now we're looking at Strickland and Yoko. We just came from the hospital. One, one, one. <laughs> I wish drunk, I wish. We just got tickets to Baby Hulk's fight next weekend. We were also looking for resale tickets for 262, but they are gone. Mm. So we're flying to Arizona for 263 CU's bums there. Look at that. Yo, Glove Touch is hardcore, man. Thank you for that donation. And when you see Baby Hulk, tell him we said hi. We're rooting for him. Hell yeah, man. Baby Hulk is, is a good dude. Fantastic fighter. Third round of action, Yoko Strickland. Yoko unranked fighting the number 15th Strickland. And so far, I got Strickland up two rounds to nothing here as Yoko trying to get a finish. But he is moving back. It's all Strickland some more in this third. 305 left, and Strickland cracks him with the left and just misses with that right. Ellie, I'm, I'm so excited when Ellie gets old enough where we can just sit and Ellie can watch the fights with me. Because I think Ellie's going to be watching the fights with Pop, Mom and Pop, right? You can be hanging with us. We can watch the fights together. Yeah, she said yes. Baby Hulk for the win. We don't care about this. Uh, the fights. <laughs> when is Reyes fighting? So this is the second fight on the main card. There are five fights on the card. So you do the math. Take away the two. You have three left. So Reyes won't be fighting for another. You have to get through two more fights. After this one that's happening right now. We're in 225 left. Nice right hand. Yoko's uh, coming in. Yoko's got to get going here. It's been all Strickland. Strickland doesn't really show much damage. He's eating some shots, but he's coming forward. He's being smart, though. He's not fully engaging. Oh, and that's what happens. Yoko counters with the right hand. Let's see if Yoko can come back in this round. Two minutes, two seconds. Strickland with that sense of urgency coming forward. Meanwhile, he's up two rounds. Left hand coming in by Strickland, and right counters in Yoko. Oh, boy. Herb Dean's watching the boys. Are you getting a little crib in the studio for Ellie? Um, I mean, who knows with Fight Buddies. We got to see what works the best. But, um, yeah, we should have, like, Ellie on, like, a throne. A little crib throne where she's just, like, superimposed in the corner. Ellie's sleeping through this whack-ass card. Uh, thank you, Detter420. You can tell she is, like, oh, when you're talking, when you stop. She starts squirming. Yeah, you know, when we were, when she was in Jesse's belly and we were yelling and screaming, Food Girl Fridays and fight reactions, I think it helped. I think it soothes her. I think that helped a lot. So, ooh, nice kick to the body, Strickland, followed by a left. Right, Allie? Yeah. Oh, she said, yeah. Get one of the, uh, one boy and two girls. My oldest daughter is my favorite. I'm not afraid to sleep with my old children. 
a middle child and a smart ass. That's funny. I like when people say which child is their favorite because you know every parent has that child. Poop. I can't wait to uh, this baby has farted on me a million times and she's only been here for a day by the way this round and fight winding down thank you to all the donators Strickland came in hot at the end hits him with a flying knee by the way Strickland he won that fight there's no doubt in my mind Prochaska I mean Prochaska hello Yoko putting his hands up like he did something there he did nothing that was all Strickland so congratulations to Sean Strickland I, I'll throw the baby through the window if Strickland loses that fight I hope he doesn't lose that way. All right, let's see what you guys say. Uh, get a puppy. Ah, man, I love animals. I freaking love, I've said it a million times, I love animals. Maybe when she gets older, you know, we'll do something like that, but I wanna travel. You know, I wanna go places and do things, and I don't know, I, I hate dumping animals on people. At least a granddaughter, you can kind of dump on people if you had to. Or if she gets old enough, she can come, you know? Or when she gets old enough, not if. But a dog, you know, it's, a, it's I don't know. It's just too much of a responsibility. I don't like to leave the dog home and shit. Ellie would love a little puppy. I'm sure she would. But you know what's going to happen? I get her a dog. I'm going to have to take care of the dog. That's what's going to happen. I see it happen over and over again with parents. Like, I'm going to fall in love with this dog. And then the next thing you know, I'm going to be walking the dog all the time, picking up the shit. Ellie's not going to care less. She's going to be yanking on his tail. Congratulations. The baby is born already. That was fast. Yeah, it came, pretty, it came a little quicker than she should have. But um, she was ready to go. Jesse was feeling it, and we got to the hospital just in time. And when that water broke, phew, she came right out. So Sean Strickland. I think Strickland... Look, he's all happy over here. I think Strickland got that job done easily. You need a party for Ellie. Wait until she's about six for a dog. Six? I'm thinking 16. About right. 16 is a good age. All right, Strickland gets the dub. How about that? How about Sean Strickland right now? On a four-fight winning streak. The last time he lost, he got knocked out by Elijah Zaleski. And then took on Talib. He took on Jack Marshman, took on Brendan Allen, and here we go, a big one over here against uh, Christoph Yoko, who was on a two fight, a three fight winning streak as well. But nice job by Sean Strickland. Moving forward. Did I pick, um, what did I pick? I picked a decision, so I got this on the head. Nice stuff. All right, three more fights left. All right, how's everyone doing in the chat? We're partying here. We got 300 people watching. We got a man and a baby. We're hanging. I'm happy to be with you guys. I'm really happy to be with you guys. Um, I didn't think I was gonna be able to see the fights tonight. I thought we were gonna be still stuck in the hospital, but lucky enough, we got home. Ellie's, this is Ellie's first full day on earth. And we're watching some fights. It's a badass, right? Badass? Yeah, she's a badass. I uh, want to buy something for Ellie. Um, everyone was so generous with with our um, uh, with our uh, what's it called? Our registry. Everyone in this community was so fucking awesome. So don't even worry. Just hit the like button for Ellie. Hit the like. And those who donated, thank Jesus. Free UFC fights. Wonderful, wonderful. Yeah, that's nice, right? Every once in a while, the UFC throws you a bone. Amazon wish list. Ah, Uncle Rahelio. So 268 with, how about this? 268 likes, 309 people watching. We're almost like, we're almost matched up here. Everyone find a way to hit that like button right now. Just like it, say, yo, I'm watching a man and a baby. Just talk about some fights. Not bad. <laughs> Underwear, put 
breastfeeding cam just kidding pervert cameraman <laughs> thank you no i don't maybe we'll have an only fans for jesse breastfeeding um thank you ride drive for the ten dollar pervert cameraman thank you so much my man appreciate that um and look at the boobies in the chat look at those beautiful boobies um ellie's gotta be she's gonna be so proud of her father when she gets older that is the man who wrote pervert cameraman it's me Ellie, I made that song. Anyway, I'm looking at goat milk and Carper Tom is still in the lead. Glove touch. You got a problem here. His name is Carper Tom. He's about to go two in a row with um, getting the dub here and you we have, five, we have two people in play for this belt if it stays the same way. If it stays the same way. Carper Tom. Look at that, man. Can Carper Tom hold on? I don't even know if he's in the chat right now, but congrats, man. Good job. <clears throat> she looks like Justin Gagey. Congratulations on the child. I'm expecting my first child in November. Hell yeah, man. Traylon, congratulations, Traylon. Traylon, excuse me. That's awesome, man. A lot of people having kids now. They're calling them COVID babies. I was in the hospital, and like they would play the song every time the baby would come out. Baby... Every time someone have a baby, all day and night, you would hear this song. You would hear that, like. And every time you hear that song, you knew someone was going down with a baby. Wonderful, wonderful. The glove touch. Welcome to the top, Tom. <laughs> there you go. Glove Touch, welcome you to the top. That was very nice of you, Glove Touch. Well, not yet. He's got he's got a couple more fights. Cootie Laba versus Jacoby. I think I pick I think I pick Cootie Laba. I'm like a sucker for this guy, and he's he's not really that good. Give us a mission. 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 Dono song or emoji. Mm. Congratulations once again. We love you guys. Thank you. That'd be hilarious. Should we do it? Would an Ellie emoji work? Like a close up. It would be funny if I just mess up her hair. Wonderful, wonderful. Like... Diego Sanchez is present in a California boxing event with a beautiful lady. Lol, I guess he's coach, not a weirdo. <laughs> Diego Sanchez. I... On the Monday show, we get to dive into that story. The dude is... I don't know what's going on with that guy, man. I don't... I don't know. I'm going to I'm gonna find out some more information. Because that's that whole thing is bizarre. And yeah, Dana White was going after his coach. and He was supposed to fight Cowboy Cerrone. I, does anyone know what the reasoning is? Why is he not fighting Cowboy? Uh, Kudi Laba I picked by knockout in the first round. I'm just being a casual here. I don't... Kudi Laba's not really that good. Let's be honest. He's been exposed... Not really that good, but I'm just going with it, man. I like the guy, so I'm, I'm picking him knockout first round. Whatever. <clears throat> uh, we saw her let her sleep. Well, actually, if I put her down now, um, she'll probably start crying. I could try, but she'll probably start crying. So now I'm like, I'm past the point where I'm just, I just, I'm just gonna hold her. She feeds every like two hours. Three hours, somewhere around there. Two, three hours. So I'll be with her until Jesse gets out of the shower and then I'll, I'll hand her off. Mm -mm -mm. Diego Sanchez is going to end up being homeless after the UFC. I hope not, man. 
I hope. I, I don't know. I think. I think he'll be all right. I think he'll figure it out. He can work for, at a gym. You know, he's not with um, Jackson Wink anymore, but I'm sure he, he'll like. He's Diego Sanchez, so I'm sure he can go to some gym and train kids there and corner people or do whatever the fuck he's doing. I, I don't know. He's still respected. You know, Diego Sanchez really shit the bed. It's a shame. It is a shame to see him go down like that. Keep Mike Perry away. Uh, Bellator. Yeah, he can go to Bellator. Oh, PFL. super chat. His best days are way behind him. The hat. Congrats. Love you, guys. Hope you are feeling wonderful, wonderful. Thank you, the hat. I am feeling wonderful. Well, I'm exhausted. I'm not going to lie. I'm exhausted. This, this little baby kept us up. But it's all good. It's worth it. It's worth every minute. Thank you, the hat. Coming in. Diego uh, didn't invest his money. I bet Connor is a Thurston. How the turd money? What? How the turd money on it? Diego's trainer should run Bellator. Nick Diaz is not going to fight Hamzat. Oh man, that would be a great fight. I would love that. Congrats on the baby. Thank you, Scott. Appreciate that, man. Three hundred and sixty-four people watching a man and his baby. Ellie has not been here. This is her first full day on Earth, and she's here hanging with us. We have a UFC event going on behind you guys, and we're just reacting, hanging out. Best community in the world, the MMA holes. Um, Kudi Laba is about to throw down. Would you let a little MMA hold to join the UFC one day? Well, anything she wants to do, I'm going to back. Unless, I mean, there's a couple of things I can remember. Like, all right. By the way, this is a little strange, and I know this is a controversial topic, but it, it said gender of child, it said male, it said female, then it said unknown. When we're doing the birth certificate, that's what it said. I shit you not. Welcome to 2021. 27 years old is Kudi Laba, 33 is Jacoby. 6'1 Kudi Laba, 6'3 Jacoby. Jacoby's got an inch reach advantage, 76 over 75. The face-off was a little insane. After what happened with, um, what's his face? Was it Jeremy Stevens? And then you had, I don't know how you let another guy do what Kudi Laba did, but you grabbed him on the back of the head. Could have fucking hurt him. Jacoby could have said he was throwing up and got his money. I don't know. If he picked on no amount, I mean, it's insane, man. I hope so, Uncle Champ. I gotta pass Ellie off. Listen, bro. I will. I will pass Ellie up. But Jesse just got how's the shower? Good? It's all good. She slept the whole time. No worries. One chilling. Roberto. Diego said that he received an email from the Shelby guy. I guess they wanted him to sign a paper to avoid a lawsuit in the future. He said he passed all tests required to fight. Very sad. Wow. Really? That's that's nuts. I gotta lift I saw he did a whole thing on Instagram. I, I gotta see what his what Diego said. We'll talk about it on Monday, I'm sure. Oh, super chat. Kudi Lava is nuts, man. This guy's nuts. Graham. If cute lab chick and Reyes when I will win my draft king's pool. Wish me luck. Good luck. So you need cutie lava? You need um you going against Cubs oh, and you got Reyes. Good luck. Chat. I'm with you on these picks. Here we go, round one starting. Congrats on the baby moose. Hopefully, Jacoby sleeps. I unlike that baby in your arms. Thank you. Thank you, Donnie J. That was really nice of you, man. Appreciate it. All right, here's round one, Kudi Laba versus Jacoby. I'm rooting for uh, Kudi Laba because he's a nut job. But I, I don't understand how the UFC let this guy do, do what he did. So right off the bat, we got a leg kick coming in by Jacoby. Jacoby and Kudi Laba. A little patient here to start this fight. How you feeling? Back hurts. You want me to put her in the grip? You want her? Want to go to mom? Okay. Let's do it. Let's do a peaceful hand off. Okay. Hand the football off. Let me know if you got her. You got her? Okay. The baby's gone. The baby's gone. I miss her already. Oh. <clears throat> anyway. It's very hot, that kid. Look at him. Full of heat. Ooh, a nice right hand. Jacoby landing. On Kuti Laba. So if you're just jumping in, we got three fights left on this card, and it's, it's gonna get spicy. Oh, there's that room! Kuti Laba with the right, the left! 
hopping on Jacoby. Damn, man, Jacoby ate something. And now Kudi Laba nails the takedown, scoops the single. Jacoby gets back up to the feet, and Kudi Laba wraps around the way. So Kudi Laba showing that strength here. Jacoby doing a good job fighting the hands as Kudi Laba is trying to drag him to the ground. I toast the baby South Park style. Wow, Kudi Laba just dragging him down. All right, I got to finish in the first round. That's what I need right now. Come on, Kudi Laba, finish, smash. This guy, oh, right hand, Kudu Lava right to the face of Jacoby. Smash him. Smash him, bro. The Venom shorts are kind of growing on me. I'm not going to lie. They're not great, but they're growing on. Oh, a nice takedown again by uh, Kudu Lava. Every time I think of Kudu Lava, I think of that MSG event where he got injured and Mark Ramundi came up to me. He's like, I got I got some breaking news. I'm like, yeah. I was with Ken Shiro, right, you? Oh, another takedown by Kudu Lava. He's like, Kudu Lava's out of the fight. It's a dumb story, but that's, every time I see him, I think of that. Uh, Kudu Lava dragging down Jacoby again. Jacoby on his knee. Jacoby trying to get back up. Strickland got the win. And here we go. Right hands by Kudu Lava as Jacoby does get back up. He's bent over. He's got Kudu Lava wrapped around the waist. Uh, Jacoby for the dub. What did I miss? Well, so far it's been all Kudi Lava. There's 220 left in this round, and Kudi Lava slinging right hands to the face of Jacoby. He is really cracking on him. Jacoby very tough though. Gets dragged down again. Damn, Kudi Lava's ragged on him. Jacoby does crawl back to the cage. Get, eats more right hands by Kudi Lava. So 204 left in the first round. Uh, Kudi Lava trying to drag him down again. Wow, Jacoby blatantly holding onto the fence. I don't blame him. Oh, taken down again by Kudi Lava. Damn, Kudi Lava muscling my man. Kudi Lava really going for this finish here. Right hand to the side of the head. Oh, an elbow. Oh, another elbow by Kudi Lava. Kudi Lava said, oh my God. Oh my God. Yo, these elbows are vicious. Jacoby's bent over. Oh, taken down. Yo, Kudi Lava's going fucking crazy. He's going Hulk smash on my man. Oh, he's pressing and popping. Pressing and popping with the elbows over and over again. He must have threw about 15 of them things on the side of the head of Jacoby. Jacoby's on his knee, 120 left in the first round. Jacoby's bent over and he's just catching a beating of his life. More elbows coming into the side of the head. Kudi Lob is trying to break his fucking head open. Jacoby bent over, stands up, trying to fight off the hands of Kudi Lava. And now we got a minute four left. Kudi Lob is really trying to get this finished. What a round. Kudi Lava again coming in with the elbows. Kudi Lava's got to be careful, man. He almost did the illegal knee. A grounded Jacoby, and Kudi Lava bails on it. Now right hands again to the side of the head. There's a big welt on the side of Jacoby's head, and Kudi Lava's trying to time a knee there, and now he's hitting with those rights again. He is cracking on Jacoby's head. Jacoby gets back up again. He's bent over. Kudi Lava wraps around him. There's 35 seconds left in this round. Can Jacoby survive? Oh, here comes the elbow again. Jacoby does pull him inside. Underhooks. Kudi Lava tries for the chip and a trip and Jacoby pushing Kudi Lava to the fence. Wonderful, wonderful. Dre Angle. You guys made a beautiful baby. Maybe you will like my dad jokes now, Moss. I love him. Thank you, Dre Angle. Appreciate that. It was very kind of you, my man. Thank you. So how about this? Kudi Lava threw a gazillion strikes here and now he looks gassed. As Jacoby trying to come back. Wow. Okay. 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 She's hungry again? Good timing. She got clean boobs to eat from. What up, Johnny Smith? How you doing? Slabs don't get tired. They like Nick Diaz in the chat. In shit. In chat. In shit. All right, we'll see. We'll find out. How's Cootie Lobb's cardio? Well, I mean, he's, he's gassed before in fights. That's why he usually likes to go out there early and take him out quick. And he did exert a lot of energy here. I definitely have him up. You go to the UFC website and see the stats difference differential here. UFC.com. It's one thing that UFC does good with those live stats. Like I said, Cootie Lab is fun to watch. It's not that good, though. I think he's a little overrated, but I, I always pick him because I just I like watching the dude fight. So, I am Kutilata. 
Okay, so I'm looking at the stats here. And 46 to 11 total strikes in favor of Kudi Lava. 38 to 10 significant favor of Kudi Lava. And listen to this. Nine takedowns by Kudi Lava. Nine takedowns to zero. And here we go. Starts the second round with another takedown there. That actually was number nine. Holy shit. Light heavyweight going down. Kudi Lava versus Jacoby. It's been all Kudi Lava. He wants to throw that knee so bad to the grounded dude. But here's another situation, and this is why I like what one champion. He's trying to pull, he's trying to pull the hand up to hit him with the knee. Oh, there's the knee. So fucking Kudi Lava nails the knee, man. He lands it. He was trying so hard to pull the hand up so it wasn't grounded so he could let it go. And then he did let it go, but when he stood up, Kudi Lava still found a place for the knee. A nice left hook by Kudi Lava. Oh, shoots for a takedown. Kudi Lava almost went to a knee. Here comes another takedown. Trying to trip him. Jacoby showing some good balance, though. And they separate. So we got 353 left in the second round of Kudi Lava versus Jacoby. Welcome to the show, friends. If you're just jumping in, you just missed Ellie. Ellie was here for a good hot minute, but now she's eating. I did the fun part. It's weird as hell. They look blue for a second. Oh, you mean newborns? It's kind of crazy, yeah. But then when that pink coloring gets in or whatever, when their normal skin coloring comes in, it's it's a whole different ball game. So Jacoby now, it's like, hey man, I weathered the storm. Now he's trying to come forward. We have 318 left and Jacoby throwing some jabs out there. Jacoby looking fresh. Kudi Lava's probably like, what the? What? Oh, there's that left hook by Kudi Lava and Jacoby just eats it. Another combination on the face of Jacoby. Dude, Jacoby's got a fucking mush chin. Everything that hits him just, just, just like, he just absorbs it. Now Jacoby wrapping around, around the waist of Kudi Lava. Shout out to Jacoby, man. This dude's face is... Is like titanium. Now Jacoby throwing a jab in there on Kudi Lava. Man, Kudi Lava literally threw everything at this guy, and Jacoby ate it all. Jacoby shoots for, I mean, Kudi Lava shoots for a takedown, stuffed by Jacoby, stands up, Kudi Lava hits him with a hook. Now Jacoby coming out with some jabs, and oh man, Kudi Lava swinging for the fences again. Jacoby unfazed. Oh, the left hand by Kudi Lava. That one stutter steps. Jacoby. Now Jacoby shakes it off and he's like, let's go. Oh, God. This is crazy, man. What a fight. Yo, <laughs> Jacoby walked into a straight right hand. He boom, stuttered and just keeps coming forward. Oh, I just got a message from uh, the fort, man. Justin Sumter. Thank you, Justin. Appreciate that. Hit me on the text. Good guy. Bellator fighter Justin Sumter. All right. Here comes Jacoby with a nice leg kick. Couple of jabs coming out there. Oh, shit. Jacoby lands a left. <sighs> Kudi Lava, another combo. Man, both boys are just landing. No problems. Just continue to fight. What a chin is right. Sweet. Glory rules on Jacoby. Uh, Dominic is my guy. But he has to be 100% to cash the check. Yeah, with Dominic Reyes. Uh, yeah, my problem with Dominic Reyes is I, I feel in here, the guy, he's, he's got all the talent in the world to be a champ. It's just, if, he, if his mind is not completely right, I don't know if he can get it done. We'll see what he comes out with with the area. I did pick Prochaska. Oh, there's jabs by Jacoby. I like Prochaska, though. I'm, I'm being a, a fan. I'm being a biased fan on that one. I do like Yuri. Uh, Jacoby is a Homer Simpson of MMA. <laughs> Here comes Jacoby with some jabs. Damn, Jacoby might steal this freaking fight. Kudi Lava still swinging and landing. Damn, this is a fight. What do you think of this fight so far? Pretty wild, right? Man, Kudi Lava's takedown stuffed. And he backs up as Jacoby whips some jabs at him. Jacoby trying for that home run uppercut and missing. <laughs> Now I got 13 seconds left in this thing. Things have evened out. 
as this thing winds down. Here, let's look at the uh, stats now. Curious to see where we're at. Yeah, man, Jacoby came back. Now it's 60 to 42 total strikes. Now remember that first round, I mean, uh, excuse me, significant strikes. 71 total strikes to 46 it is. I mean, listen, Jacoby had nothing in that first round. So Jacoby's coming back here. I'm still going to give it to Kuti Lava, but it could come down to this third. Who do you think won that second? I'm curious what you guys think in the chat. Did y'all have the baby of so congrats? Thank you, Joshua. Yes, she was just on the stream, but she is now she's she's enjoying some breast milk. Glove touch is one one. Both are gassed, but Ian looked more sluggish. Where's the chick though? Has she popped? Yes, Adele. Yes, um, she had the baby yesterday, and she's here today. Somehow we're somehow somehow we're here. She's even a bigger trooper because last night I tried to stay up. I held the baby, tried to let her sleep. That barely lasted. And then the baby finally fell asleep. We got what? How many hours did we get in? Three. Yeah, I might have got a little extra on that one. She got up, took care of the baby. So three or four hours last night, but it's just not bad. It could be worse, I guess, right? Here we go. Round number three, Kuti Lava versus Chandler, but... We're gonna have to get used to this. I've slept on a lot of couches, hence the experience, uh, expensive child support. <laughs> My God. Carpet Tom on top. Yeah, Carpet Tom's killing it, man, once again. So a lot of people are saying 1-1. One, one. Let's see. Is Jacoby from Detroit? The guy rocking the uh, uh, Springfield, Illinois. Well, not far. You got that D. You got that D tattoo. Getting Nikola Tesla sleep hours. <laughs> Welcome to fatherhood, man. LOL, no sleep till Brooklyn. I mean, six months. Yeah. Oh, man. It's kind of weird because, we're, oh, there's a head kick, Jacoby. Right on the beard of Kuti Lava. Yeah, with what we do here, I. Uh, it's going to be interesting. Fight Buddies, I don't think it would be too much of a problem. It can go on or off. Like The problem is the breastfeeding. How long is the breastfeeding going to go for? That could be the problem. They want to know if there's going to be a breastfeeding cam. No. Okay, she confirmed it's not happening. What if I do? It's funny when I have the baby next to me. I feel like like family guy. Like I was I was in the uh, hospital. I had the baby next to me trying to calm her down. And I was just like, give her to daddy. I'm like, oh, okay. So she starts calming down. And then all of a sudden the face starts coming near my nipple. I almost did a Peter Griffin. I did. Yeah. And the nurse is laughing. I'm like, should I give her some? <laughs> that sweet man milk. <laughs> oh, God. But then I was like, ah, I can't do that because she'll get all hair in her mouth. All right, here we go. Oh, my God. They're both slugging away here. Kuti Lava and Jacoby could come down to this round. By the way, the Mirab versus uh, Cody Stamen fight was pretty fiery, too. Cody Stamen brought it. Mirab got the win. <clears throat> I'm officially a dad. That's right, man. It's kind of weird, huh, seeing us at the Apex. And I actually can hear what's going on, which we don't, in the studio, we don't hear. But it's all quiet. You don't realize how cool it is to have that crowd back. Damn, this Apex stuff is it's so watered down. I mean, the fights are still good. That's why I don't mind listening to these things with no sound. The Apex fights, you don't need the sound, man. Ooh, there's a nice left. Jacoby coming. By the way, Jacoby's face definitely showing more damage. Beautiful 1-2 by Kuti Laba. So now we got 205 left. Who the hell's going to win this fight? Do you guys, uh, Kuti Lava probably got a 10-8 in the first, though, right? You would imagine. Oh, the fly knee by Jacoby. Lands on Kuti Lava. But Kuti Lava grabs a single and pushes Jacoby to the fence. Wow. Uh, I bet you'd be streaming more since you're going to be up a lot. Yeah, you might find some random ass streams. <laughs> like 4 in the morning. <laughs> yeah, hit the notification bell. On this channel and not the MMA holes. On her second channel as well. You never you never know, man. Can Jacoby finish? No. We got 124 left in this thing. And I mean, listen, he's got he's got oh maybe. 
He's got Kudilaba against the fence. He's got he's wrapping around the waist. Now Kudilaba is showing some damage on his face. Imagine Jacoby gets the finish. That'd be nuts. Oh, it's a nice knee by Jacoby. Kudilaba is hurt, man. Oh, Jacoby going for the takedown. Oh. Yo, this guy might have won the fight. Yo, Kudilaba might take an L. 53 seconds and Jacoby completely swung. Oh, there's the right hand by Kudi Lava. I can't, man. Jacoby grabbing Kudi Lava, throwing him against the cage. 40 seconds left. Oh, this is a great fight. This is nuts. Think about how the first round was going down and Kudi Lava was killing this dude. Jacoby just ate everything. And he might have won the fight. You know what you might get? You might get a draw. Oof, nice left hand by Jacoby. Yeah, I'm giving this hand round to Jacoby. Ah. Welcome to the Dad Club. Thank you. Thank you, Johnny Smith. <laughs> uh, get uh, protected to the point of the cycle. Yeah, I have a feeling that's going to be a problem. Man, a takedown, Jacoby, left hand. Ooh, who won this fight? I think I took an L. Damn, I picked Sakuri Lava like, a, like another fucking... Like a, like a freaking casual. I knew it, man. I, t I told you before the fight that Cootie Lob is overrated. I was a complete fan with my pick. Both fighters 50 Gs. That, yeah, what do you think? I was fighting tonight? Could have been. I didn't see the, the uh, all the prelims. I just saw the weird-ass last fight. The Aljo fight. Gigan X, that's right. Chikadze. Uh, Cian says, not the fight of the night. Draw says, Jonathan. He ain't gonna get his ass whooped. Has to be a draw. Yeah, I could be. I would. Did you watch enough of that fight to know? What do you think? Did you watch that fight enough to know, or are you just kind of chilling? It's okay, you're not on the hook. You had a rough day. Chilling. Chilling. Yeah, she got the baby. Baby, is she sleeping on you? She's eating booby. Does it feel weird? Are you used to it now? What happens if you have twins? You put one on each boob? That's crazy, man. Imagine having boobs and then feeding another human being from your boobs. Definitely a draw. So a lot of people saying draw. What do you guys think? Dominic gets uh, submitted. Please don't be a draw. Yeah, that would suck. They would run it back. You know it. It's not going to be the first time. Kudi Lava had that happen. Let's see. Both fighters with their hands up. Joe Martinez. Twenty nine twenty eight Jacoby. Twenty nine twenty eight Kudi Lava. Split draw, baby. What? You, yeah. <laughs> Are you surprised? Remember when I said that first round? Wow. Yeah. Uh, it's not surprising, man. Noise. You know they'll run this back. There is not a doubt in my mind. Like... Kudi Lava, the king of running back fights. All right, so we'll get to watch that again. I haven't slept. No, uh, I, it was a rough. I had a rough night. I had a rough night. <clears throat> that makes sense. I watched the fight. Bad score, hundred percent draw, not split. Oh, you're saying hundred percent? Eh, draws a draw, right? What a horrible fight card. So what do you guys think so far? Ellie don't like it. Not digging this card. Do bets push? Yeah, that would be a push. So that means Carper. Actually, that's good for Carper in our Pick'em League. Let's look at the Pick'em League here. Let's look at Goat Milk, right? And we keep Carper in place. Damn, this kid's gonna fuck it. Carper Tom. 525 of points. The next one is... 
Brosif MMA 475 and Stalio 2 475. Damn. All right, Carper. This year we haven't had back to back champs, right? Have we done? Is, did Glove Touch go back to back? Or I think he had one in between, right? I don't remember. I know he has two. May 15th, Chandler Oliveira. Damn, it's right around the corner. Ellie, you ready? <laughs> We're going to do this with a baby. How do you think it's going to be with the baby in the studio? How are we going to do this? You worried? <laughs> She's like... <laughs> and how long is the breastfeeding? Yeah, because once it goes to formula or anything like that, then it's a lock. And then when she sleeps nights, we stream nights anyway, so. So then we're good. Okay, we'll be good. We'll be good to go. But it's going to be an interesting couple of months. It's going to be an interesting year. Oh, man. Did you all hear the baby? What What baby? What the hell? He looks sleepy. Yeah, I'm I'm, t I'm shot, man. I'm shot, but I do want to see these fights. I'm really interested in seeing these fights. So I was like, fuck it. Let's go live, man. 400 people watching with 338 likes. Let's go, people. Like the stream. Like the stream right now. Dad, dad mode in full effect. He's 24-7 monitoring for the first year pretty much. I like the NFL. Uh, 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 uh. You don't curse it. Hope you have a son next. What was the DQ from earlier in the card? That was um, Marcos. She freaking, um, what was that chick's name that she fought? I picked the other girl. I got the win, but the girl aljoed it like horrifically. I'm talking like that uh, Panero, Luana Panero. Joke. It was an up kick and Panero like delay reaction. She like gets hit with it. She like looks at the ref and she's like, NBA style flops. Crazy, man. I tell you what, if you can flop, if you can flop in hockey, right? You can get a penalty for like diving in hockey. That's why hockey does it so right. You're allowed to fight in hockey. You get penalized, but you're still allowed to fight. If you dive, if you fake, like in hockey, if you fake a penalty, you get a penalty for it. It should be like that in the UFC. If you straight up fake Something like you should get nailed. I mean, that was, it was crazy, man. It was so crazy. You know, it's it, the Aljo thing I get, man. That was an illegal knee and we can all clown around about it. And we have him as an emoji and, you know, he could, maybe he did embellish it. But it wasn't a legal knee to the fucking side of the head. This here, this up kick was insane. It was so, it was such an insane act. That was the last fight of the preliminaries, if you're wondering what I'm talking about. I mean, maybe some people might disagree, but it was nuts. And that's what we stepped into. We came back from the hospital. I turned on the ESPN. By the way, link in the description. We don't have a pin in the live chat, but ESPN Plus, if you want to watch the fights, there's a link down below. Everyone that uses our link that signs up uh, helps us out tremendously. I see the Aljo's in the chat. What up, the Aljo's in the chat? Aljo uh, harnessed his inner... <laughs> Manu Ginobili. Oh, uh, God. Yeah, man. Like, basketball players. I love basketball. Go Detroit Pistons. I'm embarrassed to say that. But, um, yeah, th there's a lot of flopping going on in the NBA. It's been going on for years. Embarrassing acting. You should be fine. In, fa in fact, they should just give that win to uh, Marcos. And I picked the other girl. But it's just stupid, man. You don't do that. Like, it's it's embarrassing. <clears throat> Presumed and assumed anything matters, yo. Yes, I mean, you, you can say, oh, an injury is an injury. Watch it back. Watch it back for yourself. She literally flopped. Like, she was completely fine. And then all of a sudden, like, she looks over at the judge, the ref, and just, and just like, like, dramatically throws herself back. Like, it was so... So dumb, man. <clears throat> Pistons and Mets, poor ones. Well, the Mets, I mean, well, I mean, it could be worse. I could be a Yankee fan this year. But, um, yeah, Pistons, are, they're terrible. But 
I got to say this though. I saw how many? What I see four championships with the Pistons. I saw the back-to-back -back champion. Actually, I saw three championships with the Pistons. That's some. That's three more than some have ever seen. You know. So as much as they're terrible, that's great. The Mets are a problem because I, I was very young when they won. So the Mets are a little bit of a problem. But if I was a Giant fan, do you imagine being a Jet fan? Like that's like the worst of the worst. It was a flop. I used to like NBA 2, Mark West, never won the trophy. I could see this becoming a trend after Sterling versus Jan, unfortunately. I mean, yeah, I mean, it's 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 bad, man. Like, the, the, the Aljo thing, you can make, I could see the argument, but at the same time, I, I truly think that, um, I think it was fucked up. The whole situation was messed up, so it is what it is with that. But this situation tonight was nuts. Thank you, Mikey. Appreciate that. Oh, a Lions fan? Yeah. Yeah, they, in Michigan, my family only got me to the uh, Pistons. I kind of wish they made me a Red Wings fan, although the Red Wings aren't that great now. They used to be pretty good. But a Lions, yeah. Ugh. I like the colors. One of my favorite football players of all time is Barry Sanders. Like, he is like the GOAT. That's why I would have high expectations for uh, Saquon Barkley from the Giants, but whatever. He's not going to be Barry. I like Aljo, but I believe 100% was more fatigued and gassed than he was hurt. It was a hard knee, but I've uh, hit harder than that and been okay. So I know he was, but I do believe he was gassing out. Yeah, he was gassing out. The, the problem with Aljo is, like, even when he got the belt, like, you see that, that, that meme and that gif out there? Like, when he got the belt in our emoji, by the way. The look on his face when he's like, <laughs> like, like that's the one thing where I'm like, come, like he's standing there like he's all shocked, <laughs> like the theatrics afterwards. I think he was hurt. I think it did bother him, you know. But when he was standing there and they were wrapping the belt around his waist and he was doing all the theatrics, and then when he, what happened? Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Uh, the diapers being changed. Bad, bad situation. Oh man, she's got a bad, bad problem down there. But that was the problem. I think they did the right thing for what the rules were. The rules are fucked. Shouldn't be like that. But um, it was the aftermath <laughs> of how Aljo was acting. It was hilarious. And if you agree, drop the Aljos in the chat. Jan dominated the second fight anyway, so it's fine. Contender fight. He would probably have slugged it out until he smelled the ref shoes. I just think uh, the rules are dumb. In a scenario like, why is the ref looking uh, like an idiot asking Aljo if he could, if he is good to continue in that blatantly illegal of a scenario? Yeah, yeah, the ref kind of fucked fucked that situation too. Amen. But you know what? The rules are mess, messed up, and it is what it is. You got to run that back as soon as possible. Unfortunately, Al got the, Al Joe got there. He is. Unfortunately, Al Joe got the uh, the neck surgery thing. But he should be back before the year's up. I think, though, right? I don't know. I just don't see Al Joe beating Jan after that fight. I just, I guess anything's possible. But and I, who did I pick? In that? I think I picked Al. Yeah, I picked Al Joe in that fight. Started off good, but. But his boy tonight, Marab, my man Marab, good tonight. By the way, if you want to see me uh, interview Marab Devalishvili at the MMA Holes on Instagram, I try to get him to train me to fight John Anik. He respectfully declined. But real nice guy, super nice guy, Marab. I'll always root for that guy. He's a cool dude. All right, Giga Chikadze on a seven-fight win streak. By the way, I picked him. This fight should be another fire fight. I'm a little nervous, man, because Cub is a, he's still he's still got a little left in the tank. Too many DQs this year. She was oh, I've been illegally struck out. <laughs> Maybe Sterling will beat him with bad breath. Orko, what? What? <laughs> Place parts. All right, who we got? Chikadze, you got Cub. Who we got? Who, who we got here, guys? I, I picked the Giga. 
I pick, I picked the Giga. I went I went with the hot hand. Although Cub Swanson's left last fight, we went we went off, man. That fight was wild. Yeah, the Pineda fight. Hit with the right cross in the second round. Our reaction was like, whoa. That shit was fun, man. That was a nice one for Cub. I think he might be in a little over his head. But Cub's always a dog, man. Here he is. Tied for most performance awards in UFC featherweight history with eight. Hell yeah. By the way, if I look a little tired, I apologize. We literally came back from the hospital. I am exhausted. We had a baby. Jesse had a baby. And poor Jesse's fixing the baby. Uh, here's another thing. We're going to be up anyway. All right, we're not sleeping tonight, all right? How's this working? <laughs> What's the plan? So, anyway, Chikadze is 32. Cub is 37. Six foot Chikadze, 5'8". Mr. Swanson. Chikadze, 74 inch reach with a 70 inch for Swanson. Want me to hold her again? She's wide awake. Yeah, if you want, I'll hold her. Hold on, let me wash my hands. Let's play on my feet, man. I don't want to touch the baby. I have to play on my feet. Well, you know what? I'm going to... You want to talk to him real quick? Hold on. Okay, who's winning, Giga or Cub? Giga or Cub? Round one has begun, baby. Speaking of babies, we have a special guest coming in. Ellie, who you got? Who you got? Whoa! All right, who you got, Giga? Giga or Cub? Let's go watch the fight close. All right, here we go. Round one has begun. Got a baby here now. I pick Giga, okay? Yeah, what's up with your hand? It's it's all stuck. She keeps pulling it Yeah, come on, put your hand through. Okay. Oh, here comes Cubby Boy. Right hand by Cub, lay kick. By the way, we'll be back in the studio in our next fight, buddies, for sure. But uh, look who it is. <laughs> look who it is. Oh, where are you going? Where are you going? Okay. Yeah, let's get a football. Let's get in there. Ready? All right, you gonna be chilling? All right. Oh, Cub got dropped. Cub got dropped. Cub got dropped. Cub dropped. Drop. Oh, Geek is Cub. Cub's, Cub's done. She's left him. Chikaze just blasted Cub. It is. Oh, Cub is hurt. He is. <laughs> you see that? Did you see that? He's just staring at me. Giga sits on the fence. That is it. Thank you, guys. Super chat. Wolfenstein, my God. Congrats, man. She is a blessing. She sure is. She's eating her hand, too. Hey, cutie. Oh, hi. Are oh, you wide awake? <laughs> yeah, you're wide awake. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, it was a liver shot. Giga him right to the liver. Oh, Cub got blasted. Here it comes. The kick. Boom. Perfect. Oh, the liver. There's nothing you can do about that. There is nothing you can do. Cub in his crazy. Cub tried to grab the leg. Cub's a tough dude. There's nothing you can do about that. Oh, my God. Giga hitting on the button. Oh, right in the liver. Ooh, I would not want to giga. Hi. Yeah, look at this. Can you see? Can you guys see this good? I don't know. 
Her face is hilarious. She's just like, what are you looking at? Hi, how was dinner? Hi. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hi, you're just staring at me. I'm the guy making all the noise. At least you might need a pacifier. Hi. This kid's funny. She does, right? I hope she loves me. She loves, she loves me now until she gets old. She's like, I hate you. I hate you. Do you hate me? Here, I got something for you. Here you go. Like the Simpsons. Oh, that's, that's right. Yeah, the slope goes where the nose is. Yeah. There she goes. She have a baby cam. Uh, the birth was easy, no problem. Yeah, she... Um, she tried to go in without the uh, epidural, and she was doing good, but the pain was too much. Once she got that epidural, it was smooth sailing. Baby came out, no problems, thank God, man. Oh, man. Four twenty. Yeah, 400 people watching us. There are 400 people in there. And you're just staring at me like a creep. With your hand, like, like she's like dabbing. Baby dab. So, co-main event, Giga could... Chikadze gets the knockout in the first round. Big bushy eyebrows for the win. Let's see if let's see if Carper is still in the lead with goat milk. Carper, yo, Carper's about to win again. Good luck, Carper. Let's see who Carper has in the main event. Our pick'em leagues on the MMAholes.com. If you want to play, it's completely free. The MMAholes.com. So, Carper Tom, a swole patron. And this will be two weeks. You know how impossible that is to do? I got Chikadze by a decision. I, I totally fooked that up. Um, He picked Chika uh, Prochaska to knock out in the third round. Good luck, Carper. In the chat, let me know. Do you have a baby in the chat? Yes or no? Baby in the chat, yes or no? Oh, well, you lost your little thingy. Are you pooping? No, she's just pooping. You like, you like. Here you go. Ah, uh, super chat. Danny Akers with the nine ninety nine. Oh, thank you, Danny. Appreciate that, man. That's really kind of you. Here we go. Thank you, everyone that donated tonight. Thank you. Here we go. Watch this. Oh, do you want it? There you go. Andy Ruiz just got dropped twice. Oh, is he fighting tonight, Ruiz? Oh, shit. I've been saying Ruiz got dropped. Uh, sort of, she's 19. That counts, man. She's beautiful. Thank you, Jason. My kids are JBM's age. That's still a kid. That counts. I have a 16-year-old. That counts. That counts. If, if, you've, if you had a child and they grew up, that, that counts to me. They're always going to be a little girl, right? A little boy. They're always going to be like that. My baby in a corpse's body. Yes, that counts. Oh, uh, that weight was dropped first. Andy Ruiz is fighting. So Andy got dropped. Is he done? Is that it? Daddy Moss, yeah. Look at you. You're wide awake. She's wide awake. She's just chilling. This is Ellie. Say hi to Ellie. Say hi to Ellie. Look, they're saying hi to you. Yeah, yeah. Ready? You spit it out. Are you ready? Come on. Come on. El this is Ellie's first full day on Earth. Come on, baby. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Are you looking at? You looking at yourself? Oh, 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 oh. Here we go. Yeah. Here you go. What? Yummy. Yeah, like that's not the real thing. Yeah. All right. Do this. Yeah, well, you're, you're wide awake. She slept enough today. All right, we're going into the main event here. But let me introduce you to Ellie. Here we go. It's my little girl Ellie. She's hanging out. She's got a big head of hair on her. Right? You got a big head of hair on you. Yeah. You like to be held high. But your shirt's not on right. Can you help me sleep? Did you sleep? Yeah, shirt's so big on you. Who put such a big shirt on you? 
Yeah, she's talking. She just said uh, Mystic Moss. She has a chill personality. Yeah. But she's got she's got no manners. She just yawned in my face. No manners. She's got beautiful blue eyes on her. Look at you. A lot of hair. Like a little monkey. A little chimpanzee over here. Hopefully she doesn't uh, get your beard. I hope she looks everything like Jessie and nothing like me, to be honest. Unfortunately, I think she's got my tint and hair. Thank you, Robert. Appreciate that. So Jakadze gets the win, boys and girls. 411 watching. 379 likes. We got 300. Bless you. God bless you. And she's got allergies like me, apparently. That's awesome, brother. God bless you and your family. Thank you, Mikey. Three daughters, all over 18. Hell yeah. All right, Jennifer Gee. Focus on the baby. Already, I am focused. What, the, what do you think's in my hand? It's a baby. I'm focused. Right? You tired? Oh, yeah. Yeah. You're so awake. Look at you. She likes when I hold it like this. Like I hold it like a like a like a presentation. You wanna try your yeah, yeah, let's try let's try your pacifier again, okay? Tap your on your arm. Here we go. Whoa! Alright, ready? Let's fix his hand. What did mom do? What did here, ready? Here we go. Yeah, I know. I know. I know, we want the fights to start, right? Here we go, let's put it like this. Ready? Here you go. You just ate. All right. Why are you opening your mouth? I keep putting it there, you don't want it. Okay, little fussy girl. Okay, fussy girl, ready? Ready? You're covering your face. Ready? Here. It's like, where are my hands? All right. There you go. You got it. You got it. You got it. We're good. <clears throat> Thank you, Beast Gamer. I got first one coming in eight weeks. Congratulations to Craig Harrison. And good luck, my friend. Look at that. Everyone's having babies. Everyone's making babies. There she goes. Takes a little while. She, she'll get comfortable. So right now we got Dominic Reyes versus Yuri Prochaska, the main event. Who would you pick in the chat? Fourth place, nice. Thank you, MMA Genie. Thank you guys. And thank you for showing up today. We were not supposed to be live for this. I appreciate it. I know this is not the studio. This is not all the flamboyant graphics and alerts and all that crazy shit. We're just having a little fun here. The baby's here. I was going to be watching with the baby and the wife, but I figured I'd bring you guys along for the ride. So, I appreciate it. Oh, ice cream. Want to get some ice cream? Want to take the baby for some ice cream? Get some custard after the stream? Ah, uh, super chat! Alexander, baby. My heart says Reyes, but my mind says Yuri. Okay, your heart says Reyes. Okay. So, I'm I'm on the I'm on the flip. My heart says Yuri, but my mind says Reyes. So we're 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 flipped. I, I'm just gonna go with Yuri, but wonderful, I, wonderful. Think, I think Reyes could win this thing. Welcome to the world, LA, and to the MMA halls. We kind of weird, but we will always be there for you <laughs> and your folks. There are these people out there called liberals who get triggered over everything. Just sit back and laugh at these people. Good work, Moss. Jess. Thank you, Drunk Savage. Thank you, Drunk. Appreciate that. You should calm down. You were getting fussy. But now you're good, right? You're good? She might need to be changed, but I'm going to... No, she's calm now. Oh, she, oh, no. Keep her. She's calm now. When she busts, maybe. Oh, and there it is. You want to change your clothes? Is it, is it uncomfortable? She was getting red. So it was like, you know when they try to squeeze out it? Yeah. Or she was so excited she shit herself. Wonderful, Uncle wonderful. Chrome! Uh-oh, uh-oh. 
Damn, you wasn't fucking bullshitting. You really had a whole ass baby. That baby definitely has a white father. <laughs> yeah. She's got gingerish hair and blue eyes, so... I don't think it's the mailman. But the jury's out. We don't know who she really looks like yet. We have family members are saying, Hey, it looks like this one. It looks like that one. I, I, don't, I don't know, to be honest. It looks like a baby. And they change so much every day, you know? It's such an awesome experience, though. I tell you what. If you've never had a child before, and then to the people that had a child, you guys can relate, of course. It's... It's like, what? This thing just squeezed out of her vagina. I watched, I watched the head. The best of the nurses were telling me, go look at the head. Well, it was still in the vagina. They're like, yo, check, look, look how much hair she has. Just like eyes up here. But it's amazing. It really is. Uh, we got about three or four-ish last night, Justin. Okay. You squeeze another one out? Yeah. So crazy, man. She's gonna look like both of you. Uh, that's the answer. She's a hybrid. Yeah, she should, right? Although, I mean, you know, I got family members that. What? You want more? Oh. Oh. Ready? Okay. Here we go. It's coming in. It's coming in, baby. Here we go, baby. Stop eating your hands. I just gotta put this in your mouth. All right. And I'll suck on that thing. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, it's good. It's good. It's good. Trust me, it's good. You're gonna love this. There you go. There you go. Okay. Is that it? Did mom burp you? And you sort of want it? You sort of want it. You're not quite sure. Happy for you guys. Going to go back to watch the fights now. All right. Thank you. I'm just uh, happy the baby didn't come out black. Congratulations. We were hoping she would come out black, but unfortunately she came out white. Uh, fuck MMA tonight. Boxing is the better fight right now. No, this is a good fight. Wait, Yuri versus... Prochaska versus Reyes is not a good fight? No way. By the way, that last fight's crazy, man. Uh, Cub took an L. Liver shot. You ready, baby? You ready? You ready? He's coming back in. Here we go. There you go. No? There you go. No, 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 no. Huh. You just... No. This is something you're supposed to like. I don't know why. This isn't, there you go. See, you're supposed to like that. That's, that's, that's the rules, I guess. I don't know. Hella hair, yeah, right? Thank you, Doom. So, for Carl, thank you, guys. You're always the best. Killing it out of this world. Thank you, Carl. Oh, my God, I'm so glad uh, we get to see this. I thought you guys uh, may quit. <laughs> we wanted to. I know Jesse wanted to quit. Ba, ba, ba. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, ready? She's wide awake. We slept a lot. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, we dropped it. Ugh. Okay. All right. I got you. Yeah, I know. I know I suck. I'm a shitty dad. Here we go. Oh. 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 Oh, now we're higher. Now you're high. Can you tell mom to put a shirt on you that fits? Yeah. So, we gotta put a shirt on that fits. <gasps> yeah, we gotta put a shirt on. That's, that's the problem. That uh, could be one of the problems. Jess? Do you have a shirt that fits? Okay. Alright, maybe that's your problem. You're like, where are my arms? It's like you're swaddling. You don't, but she does like to be high, so we're gonna keep her high for now. Uh, way better than Ray is. Really? This boxing match is crazy. Two Mexicans going at it. She was 7.1 pounds. No, she was small. She was 6'8". Tiny. You're tiny. Look at her tiny little face. Look at her tiny little face. It's like a little peanut, right? A little peanut head. A little peanut head. What are you looking at? I was just looking at the pictures. God bless. Thank you. Future champ. Uh, and anything she, uh, she, those or does, I got, I'm, thank you, man. She's gonna be a champ. No matter what, we support, unless she's a liberal. Then we don't, no, I'm kidding, I don't. Wrestler, Ruiz is going nuts. Wow, so it's a good fight, huh? What do you think, Ruiz? You think Andy Ruiz is gonna get it done? 
Yeah. Let's put you in a shirt that fits. Are you are you pooping? Are you pooping? Yeah. Are you pooping? Oh no. Alright, here we go. Prachasa is about to come out. And we're gonna pass you off to mom, okay? Alright? Yeah. You're either pooping or you're just uncomfortable. Alright, here we go. I have a feeling she took a dump. That's what I'm guessing. All right, so Prochaska got the. Uh, well, he's dancing on his way out. I, I like Prochaska, man. He's a he's a savage. This dude, this dude is. I don't know what he's doing though. He's doing this weird ass like warrior dance and shit. I <sighs> need a bidet. You take a picture of her every day and do the first. You know, I was thinking about that, Lurk. I was actually thinking about that today. Where you just take a picture every day, boop, 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 and then when she gets to a certain age, like you show it, and it's like an animated thing. It's a lot of work. <laughs> Only two ways to check. Uh, Ray's gonna catch Prochaska with his hands down. Now this is a fight. I don't understand, man. People are talking about the boxing. This is a fight. Nine fight knockout streak for Yuri Prochaska. Who you who you got winning, Prochaska or Reyes? Was she hungry? Oh. Oh, she. I, I didn't have the goods to feed her. She was hungry. So all else failed, she's hungry. This girl can eat, man. Right? I don't know. Well, she was getting a little antsy before. She might be getting hot, too. Yeah, right? You think she's too hot? I agree, Reyes catches him with the first... Wow! See, I got Prochaska, but Reyes, he's due, right? Here we go, Prochaska's in there. Prochaska's nuts, man. <sighs> he is pumped. All right, here we go, here we go, baby. Final fight, main event, let's go, let's wake up. Let's wake up, the baby's, baby's on the tit. Prochaska's in the cage, he's got the weirdest man bun I've ever seen. He's got the beard going, his legs are wide, he's going back and forth, he's stomping on the ca on the mat. <laughs> Oh, here we go. Oh, oh super here, right? shy. <laughs> yeah, that's what I would do, right? The hat. What's up with the goofy ponytail Yuri is rocking? He looks like a bumper car. You know how the bumper car has the, the metal thing stuck to the ceiling so it gets the electricity and it's sparking? So he looks like. He looks like a human bumper car. Like this, like... <laughs> like he should be running around the cage. I don't know what the hell that is. <clears throat> Yuri will be the one to take Jan's belts as Victor. Reyes, Reyes. So, Carper needs Yuri. Here he comes. Uh, Dominic Reyes got the half Mexican, half American. This guy uh, took John Jones, put a, put up a, a, a war. A war with John Jones. But then gets finished by Blahovich. And here he is. He is singing on the way out. All right, let's see. I mean, he's got all the tools. Dominic Reyes, he's a big dude. He's powerful. He's got a lot of weapons. He even has a wrestling background. So the guy could pretty much win anyway. Let's see how he does it here. Oh, he has a bull's hair. Is she getting hot? Yeah. Can I put the air on? Higher? Yeah, just crank the air up a little bit. Was it on 80 you have it on? What'd you have it on? 79? Yeah, she's probably getting hot. Maybe that's what it was. Hmm. This is how we do it. Reza still looks like Crash Bandicoot. Reza looks good. Who here has the bolster with the hair like that? Uh, big fight for him, yeah. This is a big fight for both of these guys. Prochaska, nice step up for him. Dominic Reyes, though. Can't really lose this thing right now. Finished 9 of 12 wins, 7 knockouts, 9 first round finishes, One, uh, 55 seconds or less. Both guys, both guys can, can smoke opponents. How are you not so, I mean, this could literally be a don't blink, right? This one here, I mean, Cub Swanson gets smoked in the first round. We can see it happen again here. Welcome to the stream, friends. 
Hit the like button. Thank you for joining us. We're sitting on a couch. We literally just came back from the hospital and went live. That's it. Jesse had a baby. We're hardcore here. We love the UFC. Absolutely love it. So if you're not subscribed, subscribe. If you subscribe, thank you for joining us once again on the MMA Holes. I ain't gonna lie, pregnant Jess was hot. Some people are into that. They say they're glowing when they're pregnant. Gaylord walkout. All right, so Dominic Reyes is in there. He's looking pretty fired up. Here we go, tail of tape. 31 for Reyes, 28 for Prochaska, 6-3 Prochaska, 6-4 Reyes. Reach advantage goes to Prochaska. He's at 80 inch versus 77 inches. Reyes for the loss. Reyes beat Jones. Reyes is going to win. I think a lot of people forgot about Yuri Prochaska. I was yelling and screaming at this man to be a champ. So here's a big test. Ray's getting knocked to WWE. Someone about to go to sleep. You got to think, right? Yo, Prochaska's nuts, man. Prochaska's a freaking psychopath. He's making all these weird, like, like warrior motions. Herb Dean's the ref. All right, here we go. I got I, I to gotta admit, I got a little tingle. I got a little tingle over here, a little chills. Reyes versus Prochaska is a really good fight. Here we go. It's a good matchup. Man bun by KO. No one forgets you. You would think, but there's a lot of people still picking Dominic. Blue corner, Prochaska with the bizarre hair. What do you call that haircut? Weirdest man bun I've ever seen. He's literally got it shaved up to here, shaved all around, then has this long, long, long ponytail, but it's a little wrapped up warrior style. He had it at the Wayans too. Yuri is my clear winner. I'm freaking pumped for this uh, one. Two killers. Yeah, I mean, if you're an MMA fan, you got to be pretty psyched. He called it war hair. All right, so then we're on point. Uh, he is a warrior. All right, here we go. Dominic Reyes shaking his arms out. He's got the look of death in his eyes. Looking very focused here. Dominic looking slim, too. Is it me, or is this like a fisheye lens or some shit, or is Dominic Reyes looking slim? Do look like he, he kind of trimmed down a little. All right, here we go. Big guys. Oh man, do they touch gloves? Yes, the answer is yes. Hey New Zealand, how you doing? Sid, welcome to the stream, man. All right, hit the like button, we're going for it. Prochaska versus Dominic Reyes. Ellie, this is your first main event. Here we go. Maybe. Okay, round one has begun of five. Both fighters have to be very wary of each other's power. Whew. Oh, man. Okay, so Reyes is bouncing around. Prochaska's bouncing around. Reyes is the one coming forward. Then he backs up. They're both very respectful here. Oh, there's Prochaska with the right hand. Slipping one into Reyes. Now Reyes trying for the kick to the body. Actually, that was like a leg kick. It was checked by Prochaska. Prochaska's trying to swipe away some attacks from Reyes. And Prochaska is pounding his chest. Reyes tries for the leg kick. How do you not like Prochaska? Dude's a loony. Here comes Prochaska with the right hand. But Dominic steps away. Oh, Dominic trying to counter with the right hand and almost clipped on the beard of Prochaska. Prochaska is not backing off, though. He's trying to enter and back up, enter, back up, waiting for his opportunity. And then Reyes throws a left. That one blocked by Prochaska. 405 in this first round left. As Prochaska circles, Reyes stands, and a right hand by Prochaska blocked by Reyes. A right by Reyes landing. Now, nothing crazy has really landed yet. So they're kind of feeling each other out. Whoa, Prochaska's throwing. Tries for the uppercut and then a right hook. Prochaska threatens to throw the right hand, then a kick to the body. So Prochaska's style here, looking to throw Reyes a little out, off balance. Whoa, Reyes trying to come in, and Reyes is looking for his rhythm. Prochaska's so quirky, man. Switching stances, Reyes is trying to engage with that left, and there it is! Reyes on the chin of Prochaska. Ooh, that left hand of Reyes is very freaking dangerous. Oh, the right by Prochaska! Back to Reyes! Oh, I'm sorry, Ellie, I'm sorry. Oh, the left by Reyes! 
How do you say you're not into this fight? Oh my God, they're fucking going. Raze is coming in. <sighs> they both got bombs in their hands. So both boys touched each other's chins and still on the feet. Here, Ray is trying to go for a takedown and Prochaska trying to stop it. Reyes gets it. Big Dom gets the takedown. I told you before, Dominic Reyes has some wrestling. And here he does. He utilizes it here as he lands a takedown on Yuri Prochaska. So this is fascinating. Petraska trying to stay calm. Ray is on top. Very smart game plan by Dominic Reyes. He is holding down Prochaska. He's trying to mount. Yuri gives up his back and then bucks Dominic off. Whoa, Dominic looks in the clipping with an uppercut and misses. And then a kick to the shoulder. Reyes. Here comes Prochaska now. So Prochaska gets up from the attack of Reyes, the takedown attack. But Prochaska nodding, giving him some respect. 220 left, and whoa, here comes Prochaska, lands on Reyes, a right, a left, here comes Prochaska, has Reyes hurt, he's against the fence, Reyes trying to punch his way off, and Prochaska chasing him, Reyes is really hurt, now a counter left hand by Reyes, so Reyes shakes it off, now a jab by Prochaska, holy shit, what a fucking fight, what a fight, two minutes left here, Reyes with the left hand swings a hook, now Prochaska with a right, and an uppercut Prochaska, right, this is a fight of the night right here as Reyes comes back with a combo. A left hand by Prochaska on the chin of Reyes. A knee to the body. Hook. Body shot. Prochaska. <laughs> the left hand by Reyes. A hook by Reyes. Shit. Ellie, I'm sorry. Is she alright? Is she okay? Fuck. 135 left in the... This is a five round fight. This is a five round fight, guys. Now Prochaska coming in left, right. Woo, man, what a round. 125 left and Prochaska coming. He's coming hot. Reyes is backing up and Prochaska is coming relentless with the heat. Reyes says, let's go. Prochaska, oh, the right by Prochaska again. He baits the head and comes out the right. Reyes, oh, Reyes with a right. An uppercut by Prochaska, a hook by Reyes, a left by Reyes. My goodness. <laughs> this fight is insane. Here comes some hooks by Prochaska, left, oh, two lefts by Reyes on Prochaska, an elbow, a left again by Reyes, Prochaska recklessly coming forward. Man, Reyes is trying to counter in and Prochaska's keeping the pressure, oh, Yuri coming in, left hand, Reyes against the fence and the mouth is coming open, it's it's dropping a little bit here as Prochaska's relentlessly attacking, a kick to the body, an elbow by Prochaska, Yuri eats a left hand by Reyes, Reyes with a right. 30 seconds left in the first round, boys. Kick to the body, Reyes. Petraska comes forward with the left. <laughs> These are like headshots over headshot after headshots. Petraska hits him with a right and left again. Reyes' his chin holding up nicely so far. And then he tries to come upstairs with a kick. Chopping a left hand backwards, Reyes. And then a counter left again by Reyes. Petraska eats it, resets. Five seconds left in the first round. Prochaska comes in with the right, the left hook. Oh, a right again. Here comes Prochaska unloading. Ray is looping a left and missing. At the end of the round, my God. Fuck boxing. Fuck boxing. You can, you can sit on my dick. You can sit on my dick and rotate box. And who the hell thinks boxing is better than the MMA right now? You guys are insane. That round was fucking legit. Light the chat up with fire. Light it up with fire, guys. That round was one of the best rounds we've seen all year. <sighs> what? Come on. We need a we need an Inferno in the chat. Inferno in the chat. Where, where's the chat? Out over here? Inferno in the chat. Light it on fire with the fire emojis. Let's go. Let's go. 600 people here. Light it on fire. <sighs> let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Holy shit. And set it on fire. Call the ant. Call the freak. Oh, call, call the fire department. What a banger! My God, I tell you what, that round could go either way. What a round! All right, we're going round number two. They're, they're lighting it on fire. Lighting it on fire. All right, here we go. Second round, they touch gloves. Can we, can we see this momentum the whole fight? God damn, this has been nuts. So Ray is coming in with the left, a couple of lefts here, trying for the right, kick to the body, Ray. So Ray is throwing some nice combos. Prochaska trying to come forward, a kick to the body again by Ray. So Ray is looking like he's a little comfy to start the second round. Prochaska looking to unload the right hand. Ray's backs up and there's that jab, the jab by Prochaska. Got a bloody nose of Ray is. Ray is trying for the body shot, but then misses with the punch, hits with the kick. Oh, 
shit's still on fire. Fucking put it out. All right, all right. Water in the chat. Put it out. Put it out, guys. Put it out. We don't want to. We don't want a forest fire. Refire. Oh man, this is crazy. All right, so it's second round. We got four, uh, ten left in this round. I mean, five rounds. Could you imagine of this? So the pace is slowed down a little bit over here. We're noticing some blood coming out of the face of Reyes. Prochaska not showing really much damage. He does show that goofy hairdo though. Prochaska coming forward. Reyes looking to enter. And there it is. That body kick by Reyes. Looking very nice. Seems like his most effective move. And there's the uppercut by Prochaska. Landing on the chin of Reyes. And something that Reyes might take as an accomplishment. And here is his chin. I mean, oh, he's he's attacking. He's headhunting. And Prochaska, good footwork. Nice kick to the body by Reyes. Prochaska giving a lot of respect. Oh, the Reyes left right hand by Prochaska. Tagging Reyes. Prochaska coming out. Reyes swinging off. Both balls, oh, flying knee by Prochaska, right hand by Prochaska, and a counter punch by Reyes. And I'm telling you, there's so many fucking punches coming in here. There's a baby next to me. I, I just want to go nuts. Oh my god! Now I'm calling Prochaska. What are they saying? Oh, there's that left hook by Prochaska. Oh, the fucking back hand by Reyes. I'm about, to, I'm about to jizz my pants right now. I'm about to jizz. I'm about to jizz my pants during this fight. This is so fire. Prochaska now charging in a counter left hand. Reyes, a kick to the body. Prochaska back to the middle. Now Prochaska kicks. Oh, a chopping kick to the midsection. That one got Reyes' attention. Hands dropped. Reyes trying to go with the hook, but that one was no moss. No moss for Reyes. Reyes' face is bloodied up some more, and Prochaska still with a relentless attack. Reyes with a body shot. Reyes comes over the top of the left, ducking under Prochaska and elbow to Prochaska. Right hand by Reyes. Hit the likes, hit the likes. Oh, that left hand by Reyes. Rocket on Prochaska. Prochaska now trying to go for a takedown. He's hurt. Prochaska's hurt. He's going for the takedown. Reyes looking around the neck. Prochaska got him. Reyes going for the guillotine. Reyes going all in on the guillotine with 215 left. Prochaska trying to stay patient here. Reyes is going all in. If Prochaska slipped the head out here, Reyes will be in trouble. But Reyes got this thing tight. Reyes is going for this thing. He's going all in. 205 left. Reyes is still going for this thing. And it looks like Prochaska's head is slowly Slipping out. If that happens, could be problematic for Reyes. Reyes is still holding on to this thing. This could be an issue, too, for his gas tank if Prochaska gets out. And there we go. So, oh boy. Prochaska gets the head out. Now inside the guard. A bloody-faced Reyes in a little bit of trouble trying to upkick. Get off Prochaska. Prochaska looking to pass the legs over. And then slips back into the guard. So, what a fucking spectacular fight here. Anyone that thought they were going to get a fight of the night bonus before this fight, well, you just lost your money. You just lost everything. Prochaska on top, now trying to keep the control. Half guard. And Ray is doing some good work. Pulls him back into guard. Ray is trying to stay busy with an elbow from the bottom. And then Prochaska drops one from the top. Oh, an elbow again by Ray from the bottom. Ray is nasty from the bottom with them elbows. Trying to slice up Prochaska's face. Oh, oh shit, Ray with the up kick. And Prochaska almost fucking fell down on him, like collapsed on him. Holy shit. Prochaska almost went limp on him and somehow kept his his marbles there. What the fuck? Now Prochaska with left hands and then rights. This, this is the craziest fight I've ever fucking seen. Prochaska with rights and left. Reyes gets back up. Oh my god. Reyes with a body shot. Now coming in another one. Rights to the head. Oh my god. Prochaska. Prochaska coming in. Elbows. I apologize. Oh! Sorry, Ellie. I'm sorry. Is she okay? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. She hooked. Okay. This girl's a poor girl. I'll just keep. Oh my God! I'll leave. What is going on here? Holy shit! Holy shit! Holy shit! What a finish! Is she okay? The elbow, Prochaska, and then a spinning elbow makes Reyes just collapse. One of the fucking craziest fights I've ever seen in my fucking life. Oh, that finish by Prochaska. 
Ladies and gentlemen, I got the pick right. Mystical Moss, thank you very much. Is she okay? <laughs> Sorry. Oh, she's okay. She's good. Holy shit. I gotta calm the fuck down. I gotta calm down, boys. I gotta calm down. Prochaska gets the win. <laughs> Motherfuckers were in this chat telling me. They were telling me that some boxing fight was better than this. What? What? I'm sorry, are you okay? Oh, I lost my shit. I just lost my shit. Wonderful, wonderful. Ray, as ain't no bitch. And as I was typing that he gets knocked out, holy fucking shit. What the fuck? I said that Yuri Prochaska is probably going to be a champion. I don't know if it was his last fight or the fight before. I can't, I can't remember. But the last time I saw him fight, I was like, this guy is really fucking good. This guy is a problem. And Reyes did well in this fight. But I feel that Reyes was, he, he went too much into it. You know what I'm saying? I, I credit Reyes for making this a fire fight. But it might not have been the most intelligent fight. She's still hot? Let me hold her. I'll calm down. Fiera? I just had a baby. And I, I just lost my shit. Um, Yuri Prochaska is... Um, he's something else. He really is something else. This dude... This dude's your new champ. Now, the problem with Prochaska is he makes mistakes, too. He gets caught. And it looks like he might have broke his jaw. Now, Dominic Reyes is still sitting on the mat. I mean, that was a vicious knockout. Yeah, I think Prochaska might have lost his jaw. I mean, broke his jaw. He's pointing at it. But got the win. <laughs> Not bad for Ellie's first <laughs> I'm sorry, Ellie. I'm sorry. You want me to hold her? Thank you. Jason... Thank you so much for membering up, my man. Thank you, Jason. You're a white belt now. And listen, we're usually doing this in the studio. I apologize if I went a little too crazy for you guys. But that shit was, that was amazing. Why didn't Reyes use his uppercut? It was wide open. He might have been. There's a little too much action for Ellie. Oh, fuck. That was insane, man. Wow, thank you for the donations, guys. Thank you for the membership. Appreciate that. Yuri Prochaska gets the finish. I'm pretty sure Carpet Tom just won another goat milk. That fight was one of the best fights I've ever seen. That fight. If someone says, hey, Chris, what? I'm new to the sport. <laughs> tell me a fight to watch. I'm going to tell them Prochaska versus Reyes. I'm going to tell them. Tell that fight was fucking nuts. Yeah, she's alright. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god, that was crazy. That was that was insane. Alright, here we go. Carver Tom. He did it again, buddy. With the 640 points, we will add you to our goat milk uh, winner board on the MMAholes.com. We'll scroll you over there. Thank you so much, Carver Tom. Are you Piera? It's getting hot in here. Anyway, um, if you if you're just jumping in and you missed it, um, Cub Swanson got hit with the liver liver shot first round didn't have a chance. So uh, good night, to Cub Swanson. A good uh, good night for uh, Giga Chikadze. Not in the same sense. Like good night, like go to sleep, Cub, and good night, Giga. You're about to get your your dick wet. Um, Yuri Prochaska and Reyes, the, the fight from round one going into the second round was non-stop action. Both fighters had moments where you thought the fight was going to end. And Chikadze not only hits him with one elbow, he comes back and spins an elbow on the chin of Dominic Reyes that just sent him crumbling down to the ground like weekend at Bernie's. Although he wasn't dancing, he was just... He was, yeah. That was nuts. All right, we're going to get a couple of comments from the chat and then we're going to wind this thing down. If you haven't hit the like button... Now it's the time to do it. Um, and yeah, congrats to Carper Tom, man. <sighs> I'm stunned. Why are you stunned, man? You gotta listen. You do forget. Like, I am Mystical Moss. I mean, uh, welcome, Ellie. Have fun in this world. Uh, Ray's might be done. Dana White not gonna be happy with him. G Tech. 
Okay, let me just say this. If you think that Dana White was not happy with that, win or lose in that fight, I mean, that you got to credit Dominic Reyes for a fucking barn burner. Like, if we're getting that Dominic Reyes in all the fights that he has coming up, this dude, dude's going to be in the UFC forever. That fight was great. Thank you for sharing, Ellie. She's wonderful. She really is. Thank you. Thank you, uh, Uncle Champ. Appreciate that. Maybe John Jones does uh, go to 185. This guy is stronger, faster than John Jones. Think about it. Think about what Dominic Reyes did to John Jones and Yuri Prakaska coming up here in a firefight with a man that scared John. Yuri Prakaska just made, he made Dominic Reyes collapse. And, and, and how do you not want to see Yuri fight for a belt? You got Glover, you got Jan. That's the fight that should happen. But winner fights Yuri. I, it's not even a question. This is my champ. I think Justin had this guy on, by the way. Yuri Prochaska is he is the truth. He is the truth. People were still not believing this guy. I don't know how. Jan KO's Yuri. The problem with Yuri is he does make mistakes, but he's a problem because he's not traditional. You know what I'm saying? He's constantly bringing in the pressure, so he's susceptible of counters and stuff. But who's great at countering? Dominic Gray is. That dude, he can he's he's one that can fucking put you down. Um, who wins Blahovich or I tell you what I, I, I'm going Prochaska man the guy's just getting better I think he's going to get that belt uh, Yuri versus Rakic you got to watch Ruiz fight tomorrow it's great it can't be as good as this fight it can't it can't be like this is this is probably one of the best UF, um, MMA fights I've ever seen. I mean UFC fights, I'll say. Yeah, his chin. I mean, think about it. He got clipped by Dominic. Dominic has put people to sleep with those punches, and Yuri kept coming, laughing, high fiving him. Yuri got hurt. He's not invincible. He's not invincible. But if you're eating Dominic Ray's punches on a regular. Like, if you're eating that shit, like, yeah, I'll order the Dominic Reyes punches. Give me two rounds of them things. Most people will drop. You know? I mean, most people would, would not like that. This guy be, it might be the best fight I've ever seen. I mean, he's fun. He never takes his foot off the gas. He takes risks. He always goes for the kill. And how many fights in a row has he finished? Twelve fight winning streak, twenty five knockouts. This man has. My God. Steel chin. They asked Yuri about the belt, and he was just like, "Yeah, okay." <laughs> uh, help her out with the baby. No, she's all right. She's okay. Baby's not crying anymore. Uh, he's not. Oh, and you picked Reyes. <laughs> Stop it, you picked Reyes. Stop it. No, Prochaska's the truth, man. The, the only thing is, if you, if you are a Prochaska fan, because of the risks he takes, he is he can get clipped. There's no doubt about it. But think about this. Dominic Reyes, who does have a wrestling background, tried for that guillotine on him, and Prochaska slipped the head out. Uh, Jan Blahovich, if he gets him in the guillotine, that's a problem, too. But, I mean, if you get a big man like Dominic Reyes off of you, there's a chance he might be able to nullify Jan's ground attack, too. I don't know. I don't know, man. It's nuts. I'm glad I I'm glad I watched these fights, man. That was nuts. That was absolutely nuts. So, not bad, man. Uh so I pretty much won every wow, I got all my main card picks right. I mean, I can't celebrate the fucking cootie lava fight because that was a draw. But um Wow. Strickland decision, Devalishvili decision. I hit them on the head. Um, Panero, well, I got that right too. Wow, I, Panero on, I got everything right. Prochaska, I got round two knockout. Uh, Chikadze, I got a decision, so I didn't get that knockout there. Kudi Lava doesn't count as a draw. Uh, Strickland, I got the decision. And Devalishvili, I got the decision. Not bad, mystical. Not enough to win goat milk because you got Carpet Tom up in that bitch, but that's a pretty good main card to run the table. That's pretty good. 
So, Prochaska, that's going to be the conversation. All right, guys, we're going to wind this thing down. If you haven't hit the like, now's the time to do it. And thank you to all the kind people out there that said beautiful things about my daughter. I love that girl to death. And uh, the joke is one coming in. Yuri is a bar a a boy. Ray as will strong counters. He walked through it like a real motherfucker. He sure did, man. So Yuri is... And you know what's cool about Yuri, too? Is he's not a douche. You know, he, he doesn't have to go like he could. If he wanted to, he could play the McGregor game and shit like that. And, and he doesn't. And I like McGregor. I like Colby Covington. I like guys that talk shit. But this guy is unique. He is literally just saying, hey, I'm going to beat you. Um, he has a crazy hairdo. But the dude is so much fucking fun. This guy, this guy, man, he, he might be the guy. Win or lose. I mean, this guy is must see TV. People talk about Justin Gaethje being like, you know, the human highlight reel. This guy. Yuri Pachaska. All right, guys, we're going to get out of here. Thank you again for joining. If you're watching right now, hit the like and we'll see you on Monday night from the studio. Yes, we have a baby, but we'll have it studio action. We'll hopefully take some phone calls and um, we'll see you then. Don't be an a-hole. Be an 